get it if I want it Gotta make to myself a promise I won't quit, keep going till I got it I won't give up till I'm on top Yo, no, I ain't the type to give up If I do something, man, I do it till I get what I want I turn a business out of nothing into something I love I got a poker face, but honestly, I'm not one to bluff I flip a switch, never miss, man, I always stay up Don't let them see you, bitch, always have a plan to stay tough This life ahead of you ain't easy, it was built to be rough But that's what makes a personality is tragedy, bro Uh, so keep your head on your shoulders Now we ain't out here moving rocks We out here moving, getting postal rides We out here making posters And we ain't got nothing to hide We move forward like soldiers You better wake up for the pay stuff Or you'll pay up Don't make love to the game, bro. Fuck the game up Change up, rearrange stuff Till you're great enough I want it Gotta make to myself a promise I won't quit, keep going till I got it I won't give up till I'm on top, yeah You know I'm on Till I got it I won't give up Till I'm on top I'm always flirting with pain She likes to hurt me and maim I'm always working to change But she's still lurking the same I keep on building a dynasty While the haters be trying me But they hate from inside You see hate themselves in society So I let them speak quietly While my actions speak wider See they be hiding in privacy With the screen all the irony To hate someone who's trying to be Whatever they would like to be We all feel the anxiety We make our own rivalries Yo, it's all the positivity I feel like we all just hate on everything It's killing me Thoughts build quick Causing different possibilities Negative thoughts will cause different disabilities So do better Work hard under pressure If you got no time Work smarter than ever Don't ever let them tell you that Hello Hi Ooh. everyone Hi, Hi. How's everybody doing? Good, good. <laughs> I'm, I'm excited for this I'm YouTube watchers. Yeah, welcome YouTube watchers. This is going to be fun. Welcome people who love Scrabble. Challenge. Welcome people who like to watch Scrabble, play Scrabble. Welcome to everyone. Exactly. Welcome to people who are just like us. It's probably <laughs> over half of the audience. <laughs> I'm Ben so Mix. basically, I'm a Scrabble player in Connecticut. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm Annette. I'm a Scrabble player in Las Vegas, not a professional Scrabble player, just, you know, like playing. <laughs> I'm Jeffrey. I am also a Scrabble player in Connecticut. Uh, I'm Brian. I'm a chess player in St. Louis. <laughs> <laughs> He's now converted to Scrabble because he doesn't like chess as much anymore. <laughs> yeah, I need to take take those down. <laughs> Uh, over there. <laughs> so long, how long have you guys all been playing? Um, that's a tough question because I, I was playing Words with Friends on my phone, which like technically isn't Scrabble, but like probably been playing that for like 10 years before I found Scrabble. So like Scrabble four or five years, maybe something like that. But I wasn't um, good back then. Like I, I didn't care to get better. It's just in the last couple of years that I've actually like made an effort. <laughs> yeah, like Stefan Fatsis said, in his book, Word Freak, um, he referred to himself as a strong living room player for mm -hmm. a long time. So I would say I, I was that for, um, in, you know, 10 to 15 years or, or something. Mm -hmm. And then about a year and a half ago, decided to like get into tournaments and really devote my time to studying words and getting better. Mm -hmm. And I learned to play when I was a little kid, and I thought I was a great Scrabble player. And then right. I went to my first tournament, and I found out I am not a good Scrabble player at all. I know that I, feeling. Yeah. And then I didn't go to another tournament for, I said, well, I'm out. And I didn't go to another <laughs> tournament for 10 years. And then I read Word wow. Freak and said, I'm going to give it another try. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think the better you get at Scrabble, the worse you think you are at Scrabble. Yeah, for uh, sure. Yeah. How about you, Jeffrey? Um, I'm a youth, or I'm an ex-youth player, so I've been playing for six years since I was a wee lad. Um, but now I am no longer allowed to play in youth tournaments because I'm too old. Um, That's so good. It wouldn't be fair anyway. These, these Never people. lucky. <laughs> yeah, you're a geriatric youth. <laughs> mm-hmm. I'm so jealous you started so early. <laughs> yeah. I feel like I got into it way too late. But hey, that's the beauty of Scrabble, though. Like, you can play at any age. 
Yeah. I I would say you're right. doing other interesting things in your youth. That's true. Yeah. That's fair. <laughs> That's true. So I think we're gonna go ahead and start. So me and Jeffrey are gonna play the first game, and then you guys are gonna commentate. How long and are I think these we're games we're doing? Supposed to be? Ten minutes. Ten minutes. So I will match you, Jeffrey. All right. Uh, let's get this thing on the road. Are you ready? Oh, yeah. Are you ready? Did someone match me already? Oh, you already beat me too. Okay, cool. Good All luck. All right, well, good luck. Uh, enjoy. Okay, someone sure post. Good luck, game. Annette. And we will be joining the game momentarily. There. Now, this is okay, a hard yeah. one for me. I always root for women in Scrabble, but Jeffrey is a Connecticut guy and go Huskies. Mm. So it's hard for me to pick my favorite. Oh, um, and the game is for me. I just always root for Annette. Unless I'm <laughs> well, I guess um, then I have to say. Yeah, I'll you have be to pick Jeffrey. Jeffrey's team. Um, All right, so okay. Annette has played Gitch, and she's scored 30 points from it. And Jeffrey. Looks like that was her her uh, best play, according to the analyzer. On oh, nice. <clears throat> um, now, Jeffrey. Did we post the, I'm sorry, did we post the uh, link in the chat? Yeah, it's. Oh. I see you're looking at. But I think they posted it in our chat. We need to post it in this chat. Yes, I think that's where they need to post it because you and I are now able to look at the game and comment at the same oh, okay. time. Oh, that okay. was just for us, yeah. my bad. Right. <laughs> okay. We're good. Um, right, so, so, oh, they're playing pretty quickly. Sorry for that interruption. Yeah. Now, obviously I like Jeffrey's blank, but I don't like his you. And I don't like his double letters. Is there a bingo there? It look, it, it looks like um, on his previous Green. turn he could have played um, Fabrique, uh, um, but other than that, Fab was his best play. You I'm was. Looking at, is it Marine there play. now? Uh, yeah, he has two bingos: Marine um, or Marine using an H uh, in the middle. Um, so I'll put that in chat. He can play Marine or Merheen. I don't, I don't know this word. Um, but if he doesn't know that, it looks like M-U-R-R -R is a, um, M-U-R-R -R <clears throat> forming your would be a good play to I like that um, a lot because it gets rid of one of the R's. It gets rid of the stupid U. Of course, yeah. every time I play off a of U, you know what I get. <laughs> I draw the Q. You get the Q. Well, Jeffrey actually was supposed to use as blank as a Q uh, on uh, on his previous turn. So, you know, sometimes we. Well, he also had the U as, as your. So let's so see. yeah, Murr like would score thinking, 19. Thinking. My guess yeah. is he sees the bingo possibilities and he's right. like doing what I do in this circumstance, which is going, oh, oh, there's no spot. There's no spot. Yeah. Yeah. This is the kind of wreck, especially because there's a blank that yeah, I'd be spending a lot of time on uh, trying to find a bingo. Yeah. He's down to seven minutes in a 10 minute game on the second turn so you'll want to i'm sure he's going to be playing something um yeah okay so he plays mew for 12 right. points uh he that's odd because he's keeping two r's with that play so he must not have seen the opportunities to get rid of at least one of them all right, so, and Annette is also dealing with double letters, and she has got a very vowel-heavy rack here. Indeed. 
I um, do not see a bingo. I would be looking myself to get rid of, you know, an A and an I. Exactly. Um, so it looks like her her best plays are what we call vowel dumps, um, which you want to play when you, like Beth was saying, have uh, too many vowels. So words like idea or aria, A-R-I-A, um, have three vowels and one consonant, so they help balance her rhetoric and texture. And those two plays would score at least 20. So I, oh, actually, idea goes under yag and obi to form yage and obia. Uh, aria would also go in the same place. Forming form. Yeah, idea would be a cute play there. Okay, so she plays Rhea, it, keeping that A. Uh, that's looks fine. Um, sure. That's very close in equity to her other play. Now, I you see, see a bingo for, here? I do. I see Brinier and Barnier, and Barnier will play. Yeah. yeah there you go. Um, I don't know. There's probably more. Oh. Is bearing a word, B-E-R-R-I-N-G, or is it just a straight? <clears throat> oh, um, bearing the straight, would that play? I don't know if that's a word. I don't know if bearing is a word. I don't think it is. So. My cat says hello um, as he goes through this bag here. No, you know, um, you know what bearing is? It's bringer. B R I N G E R. Oh, okay. um, oh, I should. Um, I, pull I up don't see a. Word to me, the only bingo that I see that plays is Barnier, and that would come down from um, H F. Yeah, that Aria. isn't. Yeah, that's indeed the only bingo playable bingo he has, according to the analyzer on on uh, oh. rules. So, actually, using the spot that Annette just created. I would I would be surprised if he doesn't see that. Yeah, wow. there it comes. There it comes. Nice. Now Annette has your favorite letter and no There U. it is. Everyone's favorite letter, the Q. I so also am not fond of the that that yeah, looks so that great. play makes sense. Yeah. Uh that scored thirty four. Nice comeback. And, and the score is virtually tied. Yeah. Now, Jeffrey's got some issues with this rack. Indeed. I don't know. Do you like win up at the top? Um, yes, that's in fact his best equity play. To oh. play win, um, forming T and and yeah, very good. There it comes. So that's what he'll be hoping to do this game. Um. And let's see, does, <laughs> yeah, now so, Annette, uh, Annette picks up the second boy. Nice balance now, that side of that. Is there an over, how about over pile at the bottom? Is over pile a word? Uh, it must not be because again, I'm cheating and seeing that she has two playable bingos here. Okay. Um, she has a seven and she has an eight, uh, which is an over word. So maybe you want to. Um, yeah, let me work on this. Find that one. Yeah. Over lip? Close. It's an eight, though. <sighs> Very hmm. close. <laughs> it, it's, uh, it's over slip. Over slip. Yeah, of course. You know when you when you fall down and you fall down too hard, you you overslip. Well, I can make a case for overlip. This is my overlip. This is my underlip. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. I'm hiding my overlip. Yes. Well. Uh, other than that, she has plosive. Oh yes. Making the blank an S. And... Yeah. Sorry, everyone, for using, um, I'm clearly using this analyzer as a crutch here, but it's because uh, I feel um, 
outclassed by my my fellow players and commentators. So, uh, no, no, no. So, so her overplay is at the bottom if she plays over slip. Correct. But that would open yeah. up that triple lane really uh, kind of dangerously. But she's yeah, spending a lot of time was, thinking of this. Ooh, okay. Viper comes down, so she didn't. I mean, those were tough ones to find. Oh, okay, yeah, so yeah. he responds with a play that makes sense. He had two. No, excuse me, but uh, that scored 41 points, so. Yeah, um, that's an excellent play. <laughs> now, I think, I, I mean, I see looping and pooling, but. um. Right, but unfortunately, those are sevens using using a letter on the board. She doesn't have any bingos. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. Okay. Well, then, what should she do? So this do? will be unfortunate for her because she'll probably be looking for yeah one for a bit. Can she come so, down to block that triple lane at least? You know, op. I. I hate that. I, I have no idea. What would you do? Oh, she's so smart. Igloo, of course. There you go. I like that. Now, um, I like... Jeffrey has a Z. <clears throat> I'll be looking to score with. Which is a fun letter. He also has a combination I love, which is I not, I N O T. When I first started studying Scrabble, that's the letters I, the, the seven letter words I studied, any seven letter word yeah. with an I not in it. And it was just kind of a fun way to learn some words for me. Yeah. And for newer players out there, uh, that's a nice um, combination of letters to look for if if you're looking for a bingo because it forms T-I-O-N, a very common uh, exactly. suffix. So he played ZD for 26. That's solid. Um, now. He had this strange word, uh, Coetzen, which would have been a much better play, much better play, but, you know, that's not a word that I know. Now we've got. Annette, she's, oh no, we've got Jeffrey, who's Wait, got the J. He just played off the Z, and now he's mm -hmm. got the J. These are good sport scoring possibilities. Although, I, hmm, I don't know, Jane or something like that over to uh, Jolted. That's good. Yeah, uh, that or Jolty right above that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Jolty, I think is a cool play. Ooh, okay, so she has three E's. Annette has three E's and O. Hmm. CT and a blank. That yeah. is a lot of E's. Yes, indeed. Wow. Oh, oh, she just plays, just drops two of them off for six points. She's really she uh, a great thing counting because on the bingo it, next turn. Yeah, it got rid of her a couple of E's and it also opened up that bingo lane that she needs. Yeah. Or she wants anyway. Yeah, so Jeffrey's up by about fifth picks that uh, she has a blank with the way she just played a six point play. Did we lose Beth or Nope. I'm here. Can you hear me? Oh oh it's just our I, our, our camera. I think Josh <laughs> wanted to point out that Hoatson was in that rack. Oh which is a blue faced oh, crescent bird. Now, oh, now isn't that nice? Couture. Very good, in that Forming emu. I didn't even notice that bingo lane right there. And Annette is Very back well. in the lead, but just by a touch. And this board is suddenly super closed down. Indeed. Jeffrey kind of shot himself in the foot by blocking that other lane. Now, with this rack, he's got a lot of N's. I look for a non-word there, N-O-N, 
but I don't think non rant is a word. And mm, but would it be tough to challenge? Hey, interesting oh, question. Oh, non rant uh, is a bingo. Yeah, that might be easy to challenge. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> yeah, welcome, Caleb, who said that Annette was clearly teeing up her next play. Aw. That was very clever. That's uh, what we expect from our friend Caleb. So, yeah, like you said, he wants to get rid of a couple of ends, but uh, yeah, yeah. At this point in the game, when it's closed down and um, and uh, the score is close, you don't really want those one point tiles anymore. So I, I, don't, I don't know what know. he would be hoping to do next turn if he if he just balances his rack, keeping one point times. I know one thing is I'm a little mm -hmm. concerned about his time. Oh, very good point. So he plays Nor, still keeping two ends. Oh, and that and... drops on Wage immediately for 26. And now she's got an 18 point lead. Oof, and Jeffrey has three I... ends, an F and one vowel. I'm thinking he's going to come down oh, from the W, make one. Mm. I, I don't see anything much better. Oh, he says. Font okay. for 14. Oh, and that plays deck for 29 immediately, really putting the time pressure on Jeffrey. Yeah. This is 10 minutes flat, no overtime. Eight tiles in the bag. I'll need to. Playing quickly. Yep. And that also seems concerned about his time. That Caleb points out. Yeah, it looks. Uh, you know, Beth, how are you about uh, time management in tournaments? I'm usually very good, except uh, this is ten minute play, and that is a little trickier. Um. Mm -hmm. Especially when and you have I do do that, to... though. If I see my opponent is struggling with time, I will definitely try to put a little pressure on and play fast. Yeah. I'm always afraid of playing a little too fast myself in those situations and, you know, blowing the game. So it's a um, – you want to be careful if you are trying to put that time pressure on your opponent. Absolutely. Okay, well – Getting some quick plays and then – Annette is up by three with her turn. Two tiles in the bag. The pool is looking pretty constant and heavy. So she'll probably want to keep some tiles. Yeah. I wonder if she'll try to open up a lane with an AE over to the left and then hope to bingo. She could bingo out. Mm. Now, what did she do? Oh, she just hasn't done anything. Sorry. No worries. Um, the analyzer suggesting playing, well, the analyzer wouldn't be thinking about strategy like you were pointing out, but it does like the idea of putting down one or two vowels. It's interesting. You could see she's thinking, thinking, because before it seemed like she was just trying to hurry him up with time. Yeah, but... Now that we're getting close to the end game, you mm -hmm. this is when you need to really um, apply some deep thinking, especially in a close game like this. And she is, she's got good letters. Now in the bag, they are still got, oh, hmm. That is interesting. Jeffrey has a K to deal with, but he has an S. Okay, oh, he plays Riku Ooh, looks very good. good. And she's got a bingo adverts. Um, but no spot. Is there anything to that R? She's gonna be looking. Oh, she has a nice play of adverb uh, on the left. Adverb. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's Not terrific. Sure that. Adverb. Not sure if I would be looking at that spot at all. I know to and have then, a B. To have a word end in B is very odd. Mm -hmm. 
My guess is she's spending her time up at the top. Heidi Robertson in chat, welcome. She points out that online, at least you don't have to track letters, um, count tiles, things like that. So it's easier to play faster. That is true, Heidi. Great. Taking the lead. Oh my gosh. Oh. Wow. 12 point game. Wow. What a wow, that was a great game. And Jeffrey, you got her. Yeah, Jeffrey, Jeffrey won. Jeffrey beat Annette by 12 Going points, up. right? That Very was a good. really yes, was close, tight game. Wow. Yes, indeed. So he pulled it out by going out with Laura's at the end. <laughs> good job. Hey, go Connecticut. Good job, Jeffrey. I didn't know what to do in the end there. I just had no scoring tiles. That was a whack. Um, I don't know. Yeah. Had, uh, yeah Rock who did know it. it would have made the difference, but you had adverb. Um, oh. I was nice. thinking. I don't know if I would look oh. at that spot at all. Oh, yeah, yeah that would have been real nice. Yeah, if I had more time, Reiko, I think I would have seen that. Are we talking that. about I... our game now, or? Yeah, I don't yeah. know. What do you have Probably. to say about yeah, it? Yeah, we can. Yeah, I thought it was a cool game. Igloo was it was an a fun play game because I couldn't do anything. I had so many ends, just so many. Yeah. Yes, uh, you I did. had a lot of vowels, and I had the blank for a while. Did I miss any bingos there? Did you guys check? Um, earlier you in the had game? plosive and overslip at one point. Okay, I didn't know those. Um, uh, I think Raves was I an interesting remember. play. I don't think there was any way for you to guarantee a win. Legally yeah, there. I, don't, I was. Thinking, I couldn't see a win. I'm a very big fan of phonying or making up words. And I think in a place like this, you could do something like re-stab or something like that. Just yeah, see if I, I can- Yeah, I thought about that, but like, I just didn't think that would win either. Like, I don't think sure. that even scores enough points. And like, you just have outs. So like, you can just go out even if you don't think it's a word. Mm -hmm. yeah, I don't was know, I was, I was too low on time. Yeah, thanks. Uh, I was happy to um, see that. When I played HM, I kept three ends because I really thought I just needed to block that spot. Right. Um, and then I was like, haha, there's nothing she can do. And then <laughs> that came down. That was annoying. Yeah, I had to set up another yeah, lane there. Sneaky. Get my bingo down. Yeah, I don't know. I probably made a couple of mistakes in the middle of the game, I feel like. Not sure, though. How did you guys feel about Rhea after he played MU, like, early in the game? I was surprised you didn't play Aria. Yeah, I, I could have done that, but uh, I kind of wanted to keep that hook. Mm. It, it I almost had, awesome like, one too. play is like, Harbinger and stuff like that, but nothing mm -hmm. worked when I played Barnier. I couldn't mm -hmm. find anything else. That seemed fine, though. I think I'm that here. was the only bingo that was available to you. Nice. Oh, was it really? Nice. Yeah, um, yeah you know, I didn't want to open anything there, there because playing MU is just, available. I know you're close to something. Mm -hmm. I want to try to keep it tight. Like, I had better plays through the C that probably would have left me a little bit better, but I don't know. I didn't want oh, to do that turn, too much. Oh, on that turn, Jeffrey, you maybe wanted to play, it, since you didn't see the bingo marine, but given that, uh, maybe you want to play M-U-R-R, -R, forming your, because you had two R's. Oh, I forgot mm -hmm. about that. Did Marine mm -hmm. play? Yeah, um, it played somewhere, and, and also with an H in the middle. Marine. Oh, I don't. That's pretty cool. I don't think yeah. Marine played M U R R I N E. I think the the well, H variation with, did. With the I didn't with, know that word. Well, it would have played with the egg. No, the y problem yeah. with all these is that I don't know any of my four letter words. So oh. like I think <laughs> it probably hooked to Yage, which I wasn't sure about. Yeah. Yes. Uh, yes. And yes. Mer yes. also I right. wasn't sure about. Mm -hmm. Yeah, good game though. That was a close one. Mm -hmm. So when you two were playing, were you playing with the one minute overtime? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So we'll be yeah, playing. It the wouldn't same. really so have made a difference though. Minute. Okay. All right, game two. Yeah. All right, Are you trying to me. I've never Not played on a stream before. I'm very scared of making very stupid <laughs> mistakes. Don't worry, it happens so, to all of us. Thank if you, you. If you Good do luck. something that, if you do something that was clearly just like a, a typo, I'll just challenge Aww. and pass back. You're a friend. Um, I will do the same thing for you. 
I won't be doing also, that. Also, watch okay. your time because I feel like I, I played way too slow in the beginning. I really wanted to, instead of playing Lores at the end, end with Loser just to like really rub mm -hmm. it in. But I, I thought, thought you were going to do that. <laughs> I didn't know if it got me enough points and I didn't want to count because I had six I think, seconds I think left. I would have still. So. Yeah, I know. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to challenge Beth. It's going to be 10 minutes um, plus one minute of overtime. We decided to. Mm -hmm. uh, start and I am that. looking for your challenge and I will type it into the. All right, good luck. Have fun. All right, we'll be the commentators this time, which is exciting. Yeah, this should be fun. Like I'm going to try to pull up the chat on my phone here so I can see if people are saying anything. Mm -hmm. um, cool. All right. So we have 22 time. viewers, it looks like. It's not too bad. That's lovely. Hello, yeah, everyone. That's great. Hi, everybody. I'm sure I can name them all. <laughs> yeah, probably a lot of them. <laughs> Aw, they're so sweet. Okay, this should be so fun. I'm all excited. of us play... It's way less stressful to commentate. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is a fun set of four because I think all four of us are at least pretty good friends in real life. Like at the Las Vegas mm -hmm. tournament, um, mm -hmm. Beth, you and me were all in the second division. And I think Brian, was Brian in the second division too? He was in the third. He was in the third division. Um, yeah. But he's been involved in the community for a long time and is pretty good. Oh, yeah. Um, oh, are we supposed to pull up the game? No, we're well, waiting for them to do that. I can find them on. Yeah, they've started. I'll just send the link. You got the link. Oh, wow. They've been going for a while. Uh oh. Here's what I think it is. Jesus. OK, yeah, that looks good. Right, same one. Sorry about that. Oh, they've been playing a lot. Ooh, funny place. Yeah, we need to make sure he gets on the screen here. Josh. All right, we'll help. go real quick. <laughs> there we go. Okay. All right, lovely. So, All right, so quick recap. Some... <laughs> on the last episode, we started out with Beth playing QI, which is a nice basic play to get rid of the Q, and then Ailment coming down from Brian, which is a nice top probability bingo. It's pretty good. Um, mm -hmm. Granter coming down from Beth, hooking to RAI, which is a nice play. And then hair scoring a lot underneath ailment, and then re oil coming down from Beth. Um, yeah, I think we're and now up, you're right? all caught up. So um, looking at this rack, what what are you seeing here? That is not a fun rack. There's yeah, a lot it's really of, not a fun rack at all. A lot of scoring tiles, but not really much you can do with it. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure there's some good fours yet. that can play above re oil, like on a worse. Worst case, you can use both of your fouls. Yeah, that looks pretty Visa, good. But Va yeah. comes down. I, I, I like to play a Va, though. But no, but it blocks it that spot, too. And it gets rid of the V and the W, which are the clunkiest tiles. Mm -hmm. Let's yeah, see. It looks like Beth has Bingo's drawn the here. other blank this time. Um, I'm looking to see if there's anything from that R, maybe. It seems like the most likely spot can... to Bingo, or maybe through the L. Mm -hmm. Ooh, there is one Bingo. I'm There's pulling this bingo. up with the engine through the L. Um, through the and L. It's okay, let's a see. strange word, but you could probably intuit it. Um, okay, she did not see it. She did I don't not know see if it. I would play I G in I... that spot. That's a little risky. I mean, that yeah, does take so, a front A and a front O. Yeah, G here is very risky because it takes two very common front hook tiles, which will both come down and score a lot of points. The play yeah. she missed was Glee Sum. Through the L. Gleesome. Wow, that's tough uh, to see. Which I don't think I would have found. Yeah, I'm guessing Brian is going to take that spot here with. In fact, I think. I don't know, even just something uh, like G, plot or G plot plays or... more. G scores more, one over, hooking to we. And I think mm -hmm. it's way safer as well. Right, for if sure. If you are going to I go agree. for G at all. Yeah, I think so too. Okay, so he um, missed the O hook probably on G. Let's see Interesting. if Beth is going to use it. She doesn't really have any great plays. Yeah, there. I would have played like something C. like block BLOC yeah. to the OG. Yeah, that looks good. I, I, I also would have definitely played in that spot. But Boyle scores some points. Um, mm -hmm. Oh, okay, so Beth she plays missed... duo keeping the Z. Beth missed a really cool play, taking a five letter Z word, Ouzel, with OG, using her blank, and she scores 77 ah. points playing Ouzel's. Wow. Down to yeah, the bottom that would have been nice. 
Um, that would have Duo been nice. is nice in cleaning up her rack, and she keeps the Z, which sometimes can be a bad thing. But I think in this place, she's keeping Z E S blank, which is a really nice rack. Mm -hmm. I think in a spa like that, though, you would take a little bit more time just to see if there is a play like you mentioned where you can burn your blank, because that is a, a very big scoring lane. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think there's a lot of things that you should consider there, especially with up top, you have the O above Oba, which will double it, which is nice. Um, yeah. Okay, so she picked up right. the J as you go with the Z. That's not really great. That's not what you want if you're trying to to bingo here. That's hey, really good is place the best to play, play by the bot. Yeah, that looked good to me. So you definitely want to try to probably prioritize getting rid of the J here. Um, I think I would, yeah, I think I would yeah, just drop that J-O like up top. Yeah, that well looks good to me. It. Um, now we have Brian in the famous situation of having pretty good bingo tiles, but no bingos. And in a mm -hmm. board like this, it's hard to score. Um, Josh, can you remove that bird on the right? Yeah, there you go. I can see the board properly. Um. So one thing so to look at. So she does have the. What were you saying? There's hooks underneath R with area. Yeah. You're putting the A yep. underneath. And the G, like the G also goes there as well. The rag. Tech works though. It cleans up her rack decently. Keeps um, the G though, which isn't ideal. Yeah, I think I would have played T E G instead of T E C. Um, yeah. Just because the G isn't very nice. Yeah, for um, sure. And Beth drawing into more high scoring tiles. Mm hmm. I mean, maybe just hook air hair to score some points. I wonder if there's any like exercise. Right. Something. Yeah, maybe through that TI. Like you could even make up a word here like lexicize. <laughs> um, nice. I mean, I it, like it. It seems realistic enough i'm thinking just something like sex here or z's or size yeah. with air possibly mm -hmm. you can even just drop x I mean, underneath t i and n a to hook nay and ticks um, yeah you could also play something like x i s would stop up top even you could just drop the x underneath the o like that's not terrible um yeah that's fine you, too you it does set up an o that you don't have tiles though. Right. And he does that. That's what she decides. To, yeah, okay. All right. And Brian is still not drawing many vowels. Um, yeah, he does have the A hook for top. So he could play something up there. And it might be worth it to it's save like the NG here grand. because you have the TING for like a nine if you can find it. That is true. Are there any here? Is stratting a word? Tratting? I don't know. Probably not. I don't think so. But still, yeah. once again, that could be worth a phony. Um, <laughs> yeah, maybe. I don't know how uh, trigger happy Beth is when it comes to phonying and stuff like that. I haven't played with her enough to really know. So what would you do here? I would probably just play something like Gran up top, take the points. Yeah, please. Nat, Nat is the best play by the bot, just not there. It is with a top. Oh, wow. and immediately Beth that plays down nice realizes, line. which is a 100 point bingo. It is the only yeah, one that she can play. Points. Um, Very nice. That's a good play. And that's why yeah, keeping that sure. S E Z blank is mm -hmm. so powerful. Um, yep. But Brian does have some really strong comeback points here if he sees. Yeah, he could play the with the area. Hook. Yeah, that. Oh, yeah, that too. Um, yeah, Rat that comes down spot. for 49. Or even Wasp. Even, if he doesn't yeah, I was going to say top. if he doesn't see the A, he could play Wasp. Um, wasp swap and wrap all play up there for 49 and then mm -hmm. snaw comes up for 48. Mm -hmm. mm, but he doesn't okay, so he plays he drops wasps wasps in that there, spot. which is okay. I feel like when someone plays up top there sometimes it can be hard to realize that there is actually a lane. Like yeah, you just it, see someone play that tech looks and you're closed like, oh, down. that side of the board is closed, right? It can mm -hmm. be easy to miss. I definitely do something agree like fess here. Um I don't love dropping the S here. I would have preferred something like WAP underneath Aria or Area. Yeah, I agree. Um, just because it scores pretty similarly and you're down mm -hmm. 80 points here, you need a bingo. Fez is the best yeah. play because um, yeah, it gets rid of one of your E's um, and it scores mm -hmm. decently. Once again, if Brian can see the a top hook in the very top left, right. 
it'll be very powerful. Yeah, you can play something like Tram or Brad, or he's got a lot of options. Um, otherwise, he's in a pretty tough spot. He can score some points with like Bed or M, but it nothing yeah. The problem with playing the there though is you don't. Yeah, exactly. You don't want to close off the board. He still has the area hook if he sees that, which would help open up the board again a little bit. Mm -hmm. um, he might also want to keep that open and hope to draw an O. There are three left on the bag, but it's been open for so long now. I think it feels just a little bit risky to me to keep it yeah. sitting there for so long. I also right think now, that with that O hook, double though, double. it's that O hook, though, is not that easy to hit as a bingo lane now, just because Wops sure. kind of gets in the way of that. But so I would much rather if it does find hit, something it could be underneath. Very powerful. Anything yeah, yeah. ER or ED. Okay, so he Barm goes works. with Barm. Yeah, that works too. So that was a very vowel heavy rack there. Mm -hmm. Let's see, how can she get rid of some of those? She exchanges. Oh, she exchanges. Okay, I feel like there was probably a play there that would have. Yeah, I think you do a sense. couple plays to the M that help close it down, like Ami or Moi. Right, right. Um, both score 17 or 15. So it's like a nice, mm -hmm. a nice play. Yeah. Um, but in this situation, you're up a bingo. You have time. Yeah. So I'm um, not seeing anything great here for for Brian. Yeah, there's not much that gets rid of that U, which is going to slow him down. Yeah, um, even now in play, this spot, he doesn't have any great plays up top. Yeah, the best plays that I'm seeing are something like Enough, coming from the E and OG, E and mm -hmm. UF, or Phantom to the M. Right. Um, just because they help clear off a couple letters. Yeah, I like Phantom there. I like opening up a couple more lanes on the top of the board because he does need to get a bingo down at some point here. Gaunt, Gaunt kind of accomplishes a, the same thing. Yeah. I don't like keeping the F a lot, um, but it does get rid of his double N's and gets rid of his U, so I think it's a perfectly fine play. Mm -hmm. um, I'd be tempted no. to just play something like QBs to the S here mm -hmm. just to block that lane. Yeah, QV is a very good word to know. Underneath the F probably would score more points. You could even play it through Gaunt with the C on the double letter score and the double yeah, word score. Yeah, you could do that if you wanted to score more. I would definitely go defense here because there aren't really any bingo lanes mm -hmm. on this board I after you block the score. bottom right. Does Gaunt take an S? No. Sure. Pretty sure um, it does not. Yes, you are correct. No, Brian so had some, rid of some. Hmm. Brian had a, the really strong play of foamy there with the F on the double oh. letter score. Wow, okay. Yeah, decently. that would have been nice. Yeah. Um, I think D vests is a word. Maybe he's trying to keep the Y fits. for something like oh, it does Barmy. Fit with Barmy. Eight, four, five. I think D vests is a word. Which would oh, D vest is good, and it plays down yeah. with Barms. Uh, I was thinking maybe Brian was trying to save the Y for Barmy. Because that seems mm -hmm. like one of the main lanes he has open right now, and there's still right. that big S. I mean, he also has S. an S hook on come. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, and she doesn't okay, see so it. Maybe she's P's, not confident yeah. in it. Maybe she didn't know it. Mm -hmm. Um. Now Brian has a fifty point, fifty-seven point play with a oh, pretty yeah. crappy rack. Yeah, yeah. In the top left. Yeah. <laughs> he also has an oxy hook and the oxo hook if he wants to go that right mm -hmm. route. Those okay, so he decides to open up a little bit here. Score some points. Well, I mean, he's still within 50 points. He's within a bingo, so certainly not out of the game yet. As Beth right now, I think that I would try to... I think you could go for another bingo with an S in the bottom. I mean, you should try to block it off if you can, but you have... I, the I would just go for scoring points in this spot. Sure, I, I, think that makes sense. I think Vane yeah, is Vane very logical. It closes it down, scores well. Um, yeah, for sure. So three in the bag here. Uh, what to do if you're Brian? Brian had the great play the of bag. okayed up top. And wow, Beth has nice. drawn into another wow. bingo. Yes, Dustier and Outrides up top would actually score a little bit more, but Dustier yeah, is true. a nice play. Nice find. Very nice. I yeah, think that, that was a, nailed in. a rough ending. Mm -hmm. um, but that's an interesting game, though. Brian, too. Yeah. 
um, and I'm excited to see what they say. Yeah, me too, for sure. I wonder if. Well, that was Yeah, a little I. embarrassing. What did you do to anger the tile gods, Brian? <laughs> Holy I have mackerel, a question did I for gag for both you? of you. I have a question for both of you. Did any Don't, of you see don't the be silly, Ava Beth. Drawing, the drawing well is a skill. <laughs> Sorry, what? Did you guys see that? the on the, uh, a top? Or was that just not In the very we top at? left. Um, oh, never thought of that. Yeah, because that was a very high scoring spot that just never got taken. Yeah. Mm. I saw it and then it 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 skipped my mind. Yeah, sometimes you'll see a hook as soon as the first word is played, but then you forget about it and you're like, oh shit, at the end of the game when you miss it five times. That I is mean, you both so played true, great. yes. You had an explosive yeah. start with a couple of bingos going down back to back. Um yeah, I realized this was a was a nice one. That was a lot of points. Yeah, that was that one hurt. <laughs> Did yeah. you see that immediately when you drew into it? I mean, you only played the X the previous turn. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I saw it the second I pulled it. I, That's yes. very nice. Um, it was the only the, bingo, actually. Oh, um, I. But did I get every power tile and every S and blank? <laughs> One, you might two, have. I remember three. having an <laughs> You played <laughs> Wamps, I think. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. Yes, I had that. Yeah, this was a game of tricky four hooks. Like, the mm -hmm. R into area hook was important. Mm -hmm. um, and then top mm -hmm. into a top or stop came important. Like, right. it plays like a wasp. Mm-hmm. When I played G, I had the O, and I believe I had a blank too, and so I was really yeah. hoping to be able to play a bingo down from, um, you know, with an O in it. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, we but that, was that might a be a little bit of play. a risky move, though, just given since it takes an A and an O, and there's a lot of those in the bag. Yeah, like even yeah. if you have the blank. But like, I mean, even hey, in that position, you could you play G one. Since you think you're going to bingo, you could play G one over to hook V. And that way you mm -hmm. can still bingo and you're not necessarily giving back a scoring spot. No, I didn't want to do that. I I saw that and I really didn't want to do that because W E E you could hook yeah, with a D, so with an S, and sure. to, you could make a double double word right. if he had had a bingo. I thought that could have mm -hmm. been devastating. So mm -hmm. that one I did see and I did consider, Jeffrey. Mm-hmm. Did Makes you know sense. your bingo of D vests when you when you played feast? Yes, it didn't play anywhere that I saw. It fit with barm. So barm is actually a noun, and so you could hook onto it barms, which would come mm -hmm. down. Um, oh, yeah. We were wondering if you saw it or knew it or. Yeah. Wow! I just didn't. I. I didn't see it. Fit I saw, really the, I saw the bingo. Yeah. I didn't see. Right. Ooh. Yeah, mm -hmm. it happens. It happens. So, yeah, Brian, these games there, are was, fast too. there was interesting play of fun there. You kept the Y. I thought, was there any idea in there of hooking the Y onto Barm with a Barmy later? Nope. Never thought. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> um. Anyway, that was an interesting game. I enjoyed watching it. Right, the only other thing I would like to point out is that there was a very interesting play at one point where you could have used your blank to burn your Z with Ozils underneath OG. Right, um, it's a hard like find, it. yeah. but it's a very yeah. cool play. That would have been really cool. I wish I had seen that. Yeah. All right, so I think it's going to be Brian and me up next. So mm -hmm. I will send oh. the match. Um, Okay, so double J. Good luck. I wish you the best of luck. Enjoy. <laughs> All right, I'll try to pull up the game as soon as they start here. Okay, so our next game. Oh, this is fun. Looks now like I've got a to talk to. Yeah, I know. This will be exciting. Yeah. Let me link the game. Oh, he did it already. Great. All right. Let's see. This should be interesting. 
I always feel like when doing these things, like 10 minutes seem like kind of short when you're commentating because there's so much going on and there's so much you want to talk about. Right. Well, uh, that's quite an opening round Interesting. There. Yeah, I think Sachs looks pretty good here. Yeah. It doesn't leave the absolute best, but it scores a lot of points. So... Yeah. Would you play Ryan above has or below? A hook. Um, I'm kind of trying to figure out what I would do in this spot. Um, I want to get rid of my Y. I don't really like the Y. Um, I mean, something like pay up top, maybe. Yap, yep. Yep, maybe looks better. Yap. Something like that. I think I would play below and keep the P, hoping I could. What would you play? Just play A Y? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I, like yeah, he that's did, probably but, fine too. Yeah. And then I probably would have kept that P to balance, keep rack balance and also to. Yeah. I think if you're going to play point. underneath, I would probably keep the P just to keep an extra consonant in that spot. No, I, I think, think I would lean towards is, something like yape on top. This word is avidin, right? A V I. -D yeah. Avidin is good. I don't think that, I mean, I guess it plays on top of the X. Yeah. Yeah, that would probably be fine. I don't see anything really I don't know. exciting. Yeah, maybe just something like Diva underneath the P. I mean, Adam and Hob honestly might be the best play. That's another one. I think I would keep the D. I think I would play off the VI, VIA. Just yeah, the that works too. Yeah, Avid looks fine. Okay. Ooh. And uh, he wound up with a lot of E's. Yeah, that's a little too many E's here. Yeah, Are but, there oh, any place that goes to that triple? I don't, I don't see either. any. Yeah, I don't see any either. I, so, I'd be tempted to trade. Yeah, trading is probably okay. I'm someone who I really dislike trading. So if I can play through a rack, I probably will. Like something like pay E, just dropping E. Um, I like an axe looks pretty good. It's probably How, the best thing oh, I see so far. I love pay E. I think that's smart. Yeah, so he plays, plays off the same two tiles, but doesn't score as many points. It's a kind of a, a tricky spot to see, though. Well, okay, that's a nice find through the double double. I never know how yeah. to say that word. I always just say it as epinaoi because I say words the way that I see them spelled. <laughs> but it's probably like epinao or something. <laughs> I say epinaoi. Yeah, right. <laughs> okay. So, so there are definitely some scoring spots here that looks pretty good. Um, reliers. Let's see. Yeah. Is there anything else? I yeah, think that looks good. Liars. Yep, that looks very good. Are there any bingos in this rack? Kernite, K E R N I T E. Is that a word? I think so. Here, I'm, I'm going to check. Sure, it. but you could be right. Yeah. Kernite. Kernite is a mineral, and it is good. Nice, nice. I'm not sure. P E E T isn't good. Oh, Hower is good. K E R N I T E. Hower is good. Right? Yeah, yeah, that would play. But. Place Kiter, Kiter probably not. wasn't sure of, I wouldn't have been sure of Kernite either. Hmm. So it does have the F here hooking if. Something like diff maybe scores a lot of points. Could play with P, play something like fab. You're looking up at the. Um, Next to reliers. Or, yes. Yeah. I like diff, diff looks up there. pretty good. Yeah, fib or fab maybe next to P as well are decent. Yeah, I mean, you could open up that triple at the top with bait, B8. No, no, that doesn't even work. That's yeah, not a that word. probably. Yeah. yeah, I don't know if you necessarily need to do that when you're winning, though. I'd probably like to keep it a little bit tighter. Yeah. There. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Take take the points. And now uh, he's is rewo rewoven. Is that good? Rewoven and over new, right? Yeah, I think so. 
Uh, it goes with Rao, that scores a lot of points if you're not going to see the bingo. Yes. Let's see. Whoa! Yeah, beautiful. Very nice. Great now find. That is pretty. Yeah, that is really nice. That was really fancy, Jeffrey. I like that. Yeah. Yeah, me too. It's not that often you get a J bingo down. No. And yeah, you saw eye. that before I even had time to say anything. That was real nice. Oh, I think that is classy. For sure. Now. So um, what are we doing in this spot? Are we playing with the V? I'm not seeing any bingos yet. Oh, yeah. These, these letters are looking very. Yeah, they look pretty good. V. Mm hmm. I mean, maybe just something like Varier with a V. Yeah. Um, keeping our E mirror. Okay. That's fine too. Scores points, leaves the triple triple open. Monotone. Monotone. I like that a Doesn't lot, but play I don't play anywhere. Uh, you know. Is there a moon word there? Um,. Not seeing it yet. I don't see one. Oh, well, isn't that <laughs> nice. nice? That's a nice good fit. Fun. Speaking of moon. <laughs> you know, that kid plays Yeah, we good. like that. That's Yeah, yeah. he does. He's a very good player. He's kicked my ass on many occasions. Yeah, he beat super me Super nice guy, too. I know, super nice guy, but... So, so I'm thinking something like Hunt Terry. Yeah, that looks very good. Ooh, do we have oh, a Turakow? I'm looking for that V maybe. S U R C O. Yeah, yep. Oh, there are definitely bingos here. Yeah, you're looking. Is there anything the with a V though? Yeah. Yeah. Out. Carve out. Is that I good? don't know. I I don't know. Don't like it. I like out carved more. I just yeah, I up. would challenge that. I mean, hey, that's yeah, a good try. Yeah. When you're down that many points, you got to try Absolutely. something. Absolutely, I like it. Definitely worth a shot. It was a now does a very he cool have try. a triple triple? Oh, right. He also has. I would be looking at that spot for a while here. Yeah, because I can cheat, I'm going to get my anagram. Or go, go ahead. ahead. Yeah, look it up. I don't. I don't have anything up not looking yes there is is there a triple triple no but there's no, an eight just, letter just up at the name. top okay let's um, see there's two eight letters up at the top only one of them plays i see okay and then there are some sevens Mm -hmm. And as I was saying last, although I'm not sure I see a place for any of the seven, the either of the sevens. I was saying last game that when I first started studying, I studied words with I not in them, I N O T. Okay, okay. Because that was a fun way for me to study, and there's a yeah. lot of words with I not, and I was relying mm -hmm. too much on having E's on my rack. If I didn't have an E, I was like, I can never, I can't <laughs> play a bingo. So, right. Yeah, I feel like with studying, it just comes down to like what works best for you and what makes you actually want to study. Exactly. Totally. Because studying is not that fun if I'm being like, I'm not someone who likes to study. So I have to make studying fun in a way that I enjoy. And for me, that's not studying by probability like most people do. So I think any I studying you do studying. Is, is, is good. Yeah, if... <laughs> If I didn't like it, I wouldn't do it. But because I yeah, like exactly. it so much, I wind up right. doing it. Right. That's yeah. good. I'm so yeah. envious of people who like to study, honestly. I wish I did. Well, but I play so much that I pick up a lot just from playing. And I, I think just like having playing experience study, as well. I should be very great shakes. <laughs> and yeah, I don't it's really amazing much how much you can playing. pick up just from, from playing the game. So it's if you're someone out there who don't like to study, yeah. just play, enjoy it. You know, you'll get better over time. Well, I totally agree. Just enjoy it. Yeah, exactly. I mean, that's what the game should be about. If you're not enjoying yes. it, then you're doing it wrong. Now, 
he seems to be really struggling with this rack. Yeah, this it's it's a rough thing. rack. Yeah. I mean, it's it's not easy. Especially those blank bingos too. That's definitely the ones that I struggle with the most. Like if well, I'm if I'm missing bingos, it's when I have blanks. Yes. Because there are so many options, so many things to go through. The bingo he has up top that would fit is Evection, mm -hmm. E-V-E-C-T-I-O-N. That's mm -hmm. a tough one. I, yeah, I do that's not a pretty to tough one to see. And let's see, does he, no, I already checked. Okay, so he doesn't see it. I would honestly Ooh. probably leave that spot open if I was him, if I'm not going to bingo. Just to give yourself another chance to hit that. Well, Jeffrey so comes down with up a, another bingo. Yeah. yeah, and Brian draws terribly here. You never want to see that WU combo, especially on a two-tile draw. That's just awful. He had out... What did he have? I outwine, but it's not a word. Ooh, Oof, yeah. I was what just say? came down and went back? Um, I didn't catch that. What was the word that was just played? Wineless. Do you have maybe? their game up? Oh, you know, no, I don't. Uh, I don't. I don't remember. But that was a good challenge, though. Yeah. So, are there any bingos here? Mungo's place. Doesn't that need two O's? Mm, no, M U N G O E S. But oh, that one. Okay, I was thinking of M U N G O O S E. Yeah. Because I think that's good too. Oh, oh, Moon went down. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I think he played Cageless last time. And I think oh, that that's is... probably what he played. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, so that blocks the board. Yeah, quite well. It really does. Yeah, well, it's going to be tough now to get a bingo down. And he really needs one. Is there is yeah rugged or blugged word? I don't think Even so. Even if they were, they wouldn't play anywhere. Um, debugged. No. No, that's I'm afraid he's hosed. Yeah, I mean, maybe just debug underneath wit. I don't know. Yeah. At this point, I'm afraid it's... Now, at this point, I would be kind of giving up, which maybe isn't mm -hmm. the best mindset. Right. But I also... Yeah, I definitely find myself in this spot, too, where I'm like, I don't care anymore. Yeah. Maybe like Let's budge just this down over to the with. D. Yeah. I I know Actually, that I wouldn't fit anyway. It's a good time yeah, to be know. thinking I'm going to get rid of I'm going to just try to do whatever I can for my spread. I think he's gonna play egg just for fun. Egg, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I bet he does. Oh, uh, he doesn't play egg. That's a good. That's a good play, though. Sets up an oh. S hook there. Oh, this is gasaity. Yep, that doesn't play though. Wait, yeah, it does with debug. Yes, it does. Nice. Isn't that? Is he gonna see it? I don't know how to say that word, but it is. That sounds good. That's how I would say it, because that's how I remember it. Yeah. So I feel like Brian probably drew the cue after all that crap. But we shall see. Yeah. Jeffrey is also doing great on time. Mm -hmm. Ugh. Well, yeah, it's, it's really tough to play when your opponent plays really fast. Yeah. Especially if you have blanks wow. and you're struggling to get anything down. Nice find. Of nice course, Brian drew the cue. Yeah, rough game. Yeah. Oh, and he's gone into overtime. Yeah. I think he is pretty much over this game at this point. Yeah. But hey, I would be too. Totally. Yeah. Yep. And the ID is going to go on at top. Mm -hmm. And that's going to be the end of that. That's it. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's just one of those games. It's 
just one of those games. Yeah. Oh. Really yeah. Sorry, Brian. Yeah, sorry, some rough racks Brian. there. It's blanks are hard. Hello. I feel you. Wow, Jeffrey, jubilant. That, that play was made me weak in the knees. It was beautiful. <laughs> I I have a bone to pick with John John Webster dictionary because cageless has to be a word. I know. <laughs> that was an incredible challenge. I Yeah, that I was a good challenge. Thought it was good. Carve out I I'm, didn't think was good, but it was funny. Yeah. I'm not sure I would have yeah, challenged like, cageless. Nice so it would it would depend on the spot. I didn't but like there when you're down that my, many points, you kinda have to. Something in my brain remember that being bad somewhere i think nice that was a good yeah memory. good yeah that was a good challenge for sure I yeah had, good game oh, guys i made good challenges at least yeah mm -hmm. i mean sometimes that's all you can do epinoa was also a beautiful double double yeah i was, was very happy with that i saw that yeah. pretty quickly i had either that or ope underneath spay or mm -hmm. underneath pay at the time with zap and a and poe which would have been the same mm -hmm. amount of points either way um, yeah. but I was nice. It was nice that it kept an E. Right. Um, but like, if you draw PN plastic. and five vowels, the first thing you see is, oh, I have Epineoi. Yeah, 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 for sure. Yeah. Jeffrey, yeah. you played really, really well. I just wish I could have lost by only like Yeah, 200. that was a very well played uh, game. Sorry. Uh, I got yeah. very it's funny and I was complimenting him in the chat for Jubilant and, yeah. and he complimented me. Yeah, we also really enjoyed like, that. He he complimented my Vrow play and said, I'm, <laughs> I'm really bad at seeing things like that. And then he played really Boon. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? <laughs> stuff? That's different. Yeah, I'm Boone really good awesome. at those. That was a really fun play. Uh, yeah. I love a good I insertion spent, play. I spent so long on Gas Yeti because I'd already phonied twice. And I couldn't remember if mm. it was Gas Yeti or Gas Aedy. Right. Yeah. And nice I always got it wrong, one. like with Moiety mm -hmm. and Gaiades. Right. They're all different. Yeah. 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 That was fun to watch. So who yeah, is up next? Display. Annette, it's you and me. Our two commentators. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Right. Awesome. We're ready. I shall right. send you a match request. That would be great. Um, are you logged in? Continuing. I don't see you. No, but I will. Let's see. There Continuing to follow my rule, I'm going to say good note. go, Annette. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Uh, make sure you guys send your link, and we'll be all Jeffrey, set. Jeffrey, you have to pick uh, Beth because she picked you. Um, oh, that's very kind. When it was you versus Annette, because I picked Annette. So yeah. it's just um, going to be us two versus you two. I think. Yeah. I love Beth to death. She, I have seen her in a many tournaments because she's a Connecticut player. Um, but also, Annette is one of my closest Scrabble friends, and I also think she is very, very, very good at the game. Um, yes, she is indeed. And drawing a nice rack, or I guess this mm -hmm. is Beth. Um, there's a couple, there's a couple plays that you can bingo through, like reinvade or I can't think of another oh, one off the yeah, top of my good. head, but, um, uh, neither can I. So in a but, position yeah, like this, doesn't have any bingos. yeah, there's a lot of tiles that if you like exchange, maybe the E you could bingo with. So yeah, it's a question on whether you play it down or you just exchange. Um, mm -hmm. But Annette is drawing a nice rack as well. Oh, yes. She has Ambrise, um, which plays down above Vayner. I'm trying to see if there's any eights, though. Um, well, what, what word did you say? I'm sorry. Ambrise, I think, is good. Well, she also has Ambrise through the A in Vayner. Oh, that's interesting. Double, double. That would be a double double for a lot of points. Yeah. Um, of course, I'm cheating by looking at the analyzer. <laughs> you, you, you'll notice I'm not finding things like that in my case. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, there's a lot of things to look at. Like With a rack like yeah. this, you break it down into its roots, and you see, all right, you have IER, you, know, you have ER, and you have UBL if you use the L. Um, so I'm sure yeah, she'll indeed. take a minute just to hope that she's finding the best play. Ambrise is a hard play to find because, like, I don't think she studied that high in her sevens or in her eights, and it's not a seven-based root. The the ne her next best play is a common word, um, starting with a V. If you want to try to find that, right, let's see if I can 
find it. Um, There's like vibremia, but that's not a word. <laughs> I think it has Latin origin. Um, okay, this is interesting. Might see it in a legal context. Oh, Balmer. I will. No, what was it? Or, uh, verbatim. Oh, that's a hard play to find. Yeah, that's yeah, that would so be I, a sick play. I I didn't mean to yeah put you on the spot there, but if you had found that, it would have been very interesting. No, 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 no. I I love games like that. Um. All right, so Balmir comes out, and that's a really nice play because not only does it overlap nicely, it doesn't take an S, um, and the I-E combination underneath is hard to get into the triple with. That being said, um, Beth does play Says using her S and Z, which is a nice play. 40 to points, very good. Choose them. I wonder uh, if there was any strong double-doubles there, though, with like Cieza or a Size. Um, I can't quite remember what her rack was, but there were some interesting other words. Uh a slightly, slightly better play would, would be as size. Um, where would that one be? Uh, a size for 50 points uh, through Balmier. Oh, yes, with the Z on the double word score. Yes. That's, it's always important to look for plays like that. However, yeah, I guess, I guess that would be a pretty safe play. I was thinking that maybe you could get the Z onto the triple from that, but it closes it down pretty well with the E there. Um, and it looks like we've disappeared on the broadcast. Yeah, I don't know if that's intentional. They should still be able to hear us. Uh, so, and I played Jan for 19. Now, Beth almost uh, has an incredible Cleaning up her rack a little bit. Eupepsia? Um, oh, my gosh. She needs... Oh, she unfortunately needs two more tiles. If the S was an I or a P, then that would play down. Um, but I don't think it comes down... Um, just are there any interesting plays to, to the triple that you see? I'm sorry, I just want to take a quick second to um, encourage our viewers to please like and subscribe to this channel. Um, it's yes, been growing it helps very so much. quickly in the past few months. Um, so yeah, let's let's keep that going. Um, Okay, I'm, I'm right. sorry I forgot your question, but, but we'll have to move on. I think uh, mm -hmm. Vapes comes down. I was just wondering if she had any fun 20. plays to the end or anything last turn. Um, oh, okay. I, I think now, Annette has a good set of tiles to be comboing with the J. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, she has a standout play here, actually. Interesting. I mean, I, things I immediately see are like join and um, joy actually, above Jeffrey, remember, ER. remember the lesson you pointed out? Oh, actually, um, a better play using the lesson you pointed out for my first game uh, would be Judy uh, in the same spot going right a little bit, forming dies and Oh, that's, that's cool. That's a hard spot. Um, yeah, those, those hooks. Judy is, a, word is a clearly good play there. Um, but judo is nice in that it gets most of the same things done, just a couple less points. Um, yeah. Pug coming down, so I think Beth is just trying to clean up her rack a little bit. Yeah, I mean, it's only 10 points, so she's really counting on, uh, you know, forming a bingo-prone rack. For her next so game. far, she's hanging in despite being down a bingo. Um, mm -hmm. But Annette still has pretty good tiles here. The Y works well with her L and B. Like something like Nobly could work. Um, I don't know if it would play. Maybe next to Vapes, but that might be risky. The Y isn't a terrible tile to put there, but not awful. And for our newer viewers out there, or newer, um, I should say newer Scrabble players, like some of her best plays are just things like Boy and Boney. Um, mm -hmm. Uh, following the principle that, that Jeffrey was explaining, just trying to clean up her rack a little bit um, to hopefully get a get closer to bingo next one. Mm -hmm. um, now it's interesting that the board is pretty closed right now. There's the S, which is a big risk, but other than that, there's not many places that you can bingo, and the S that um, Beth is keeping there doesn't play. It won't hook onto any words. It's helpful because it's a nice tile. Um, sure. But 
if she had to drop it for some more points, it might be worth doing because of the board, mm -hmm. as you were saying. And in fact, because of that, I might have preferred that Beth play Peck next to Vapes going down. It's a couple less points, but it allows you to use your S, and it keeps the game open when you're down a little bit. I mean, the S is very, very powerful good. here, especially when two have been played already. And that has at least one other hook, right? H, maybe? Yes, yes, I think you're right. And the K, but that's going to probably not be too impactful. Um, but yeah, of course. Now, this type of rack is my least favorite, just because it... I'm sure there's some good five that plays somewhere that's very nice. Oh, Zinko is a nice find to clean up that rack. Yeah. Those, um, those short uh, Z words. Q, J, X. Yeah, very good to know. Oh, very nice. I was about to say we find ourselves in the exact position I was describing where she has a bingo but no place to play with the S. However, she does have another S on the board and she can drop down Sautoirs. Very good. Very nice. That was her only bingo. Um, she found it pretty quick. Though. Annette has an interesting play with a P of Eola Pile, um, but I don't think it goes <laughs> down. Oiled is a very interesting play there. Wow. It's very risky. That's very aggressive. Mm -hmm. I don't see that I might from even Annette prefer, too often. I might even prefer something like Oleo to the triple on the bottom, just because it is a little bit less risky, but she yeah. believes that she can come back. And if there is a time that you want to be risky, after your opponent's bingo is a nice time because they haven't had any time to clean up their rack to balance things out. So they're more likely to have a terrible lack, rack than any other turn in the game. That's a great point. Um, did she have something like Oh my god, she had, she had a triple-triple of fig warts. Wow. Fig warts is As crazy. Faust is also a great George play. I don't know that. Is Swifting yes, is. good? Oh wait, it's Faust is no good. But Faust is I, no good. If not for that. If not for That's that, it funny. is her second best played behind Fig Wars. Yep. Oh, oh nice she challenge by it. Annette. That's incredible. I can't believe that she knows that she's not only confident that it's not it's one thing to be confident of a play that you make. It's another thing to be confident that your opponent is wrong. Um, and she does that here. Now, was Swifting a possible play? Uh, through the eye, is that not a word? Well, um, it, it, it would, it, if swifting would swifting would play, it, it's not. No, there's no swifting. Must not be a word. It doesn't play. Mm -hmm. or it's not showing up to analyze her, I should say. Yeah. All right. So um, Aoi comes down, cleaning up the top spot and helping out with her tiles. Mm -hmm. And face him down. So you might say that Annette knew all along that her opponent would challenge after the oiled, and that's why she played it. <laughs> really thinking ahead there. Yeah, um, that's just four dimensional scrap. Wow, Faust is an incredible challenge because there is another version of Faust that I feel like I've heard of before. I might be wrong. Um, With a U, that, that would be a word, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm not sure. All right, Village is a nice play here. Gets the V on the double word score. Back-to-back um, -back 30 point plays. Ooh, that's very a good very play cute wood, play. Right? Um, that's a cute play because Beth had no vowels. She couldn't really capitalize oh, wow. on anything. Um, but I think now you might want to look around and notice that the Q hasn't been played yet and there is now that nice Q trip up on the top that's hard to block. Um, I'm not sure how well you can capitalize on that, but it's interesting to know. And will Annette be bingoing here? Um, I don't think she will. She has nice tiles. Wow. We're just getting, sorry, we're getting some quick plays here. Unrated, very nice. Oh, very nice. All right, Beth. Oh, that was Annette playing down another bingo. Yep. Fawn is an interesting play. Um, oh, and Beth has the next blank. Mm -hmm. So she's down by about a bingo, but come down there's here. one. Um, let's uh, see if we can find it. There's ladder. Oh no, that doesn't work. Um, so it's a high probability, of course. Um, I'll I'll tell you it plays above how. Yeah, I, I see that must. Um, for some reason, it's slipping my head. You can't play the er there, which is a little bit annoying. Um, 
Can I ask what the blank is? All right. Uh, it's an I. I? Oh, trailer and retrial. Interesting. There you go. Mm -hmm. um, it's still a weird... That's a hard one to find because it doesn't use the ER the way you'd think it to be used. And the I... At the same like time, right now, you should be looking at R-E. The... So maybe... You so know, this you... place... At this point, I feel like they're both players are still in the game a lot. Um, there are some interesting fond hooks, like a U can go beneath there for fondue, um, so can an oh, S. But both of those, all S's and all U's, have been played already. Um, and yeah, now so there's just some heavy point. hitting tiles coming back with the K, the Q, the X. Um, I think it's critical that Beth tr find retrial here. Uh, I, I agree. So she's taking her time as she should in this. And she Very finds good. it. That's yeah. great. What a game! Uh, uh, so that that puts her down by just eight. Mm -hmm. Annette now, has the, the problem Q. with the retrial is it give, puts the R right in that triple lane. However, Annette mm -hmm. is going to be hindered by her Q, which doesn't have very many words. Well, you pointed out that spot at J, at J2. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so And she does just drop that, that down. One thing that I might consider 31. is that that Q spot is probably safe. Like, not much is going to happen to it. It's not worth it for anyone else to play there. So it might be smarter to try to block down that triple to start. Um, just because it's a really risky spot. I'm sure that Beth right now is going to score a lot with something like Hiker or... Um, can you help me out? What else does she have there? Oh. Exhort. Exhort. Or even just EX plays for a lot underneath retrial with the E. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Or XI. Or OX. XI too? Exhort oh, no, would uh, be a good play. XI oh, Exhort with the H. Right. Interesting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, that would score a lot. Um, that would put her right back into the game. Jeffrey uh, actually says that actually that he thinks that might have been the easiest Q drop ever. So really, um, yeah. So. I feel like in this end game that it's spot is safe, and it's smarter to block down the super open lanes when you can win with that. All right, so she plays hiker. Um, mm -hmm. So what's I mean, a, oh, it's a tie score. Axer typo really doesn't know what he's talking about. He hasn't been around the scene oh, yeah. long, and I don't think he has that much skill when it comes to games like this. Um, it's true. So. He has no credentials to his name. No, um, nothing to back up his. Hiker comes down, which is a good play, but Annette is going to have some really nice overlaps with Tamed or, um, or Dated or something. Tamed comes down, Tamed. which scores a lot of points. Um, it's going to be up to Beth to see if she can drop down this X for a lot of points. The, the only spots I'm seeing that are good are above retrial with OX. Need to look but, more to the right of the board. Ooh. Oh, you can play OX underneath village, which will score a good amount. But then I think that's still that's 37 points, and so it loses the game. It brings her right, just uh, about in Annette line, and that will have many places to go out. Yeah. Good game, yeah, she can go out underneath un unrated or underneath figs. Um, is Ox still Beth's best play? I assume so, right? Yes. I mean, for Echo. Ooh, and oh, she, she plays off there. That's okay. At this last point in the game, it's not going to make too much of a difference. Just a couple of points. But Annette, so Annette just it. Uh, 401 to 378. Very, very close mm -hmm. battle. Very exciting to watch. Yeah. Glad that was a very glad close glad game. Some, <sighs> wow. Glad some people are having close games. <laughs> Oh, yeah. I think I really <laughs> blew that one pretty bad. Oh, was, was, All right. was the X guys... the last tile in the bag? No. no. Oh, wow. Um, okay, so you I probably had out... X or XI, right? Can I point out a fun play? Mm -hmm. You had an uh, export yes. through the R. Um, oh, that would have been H and the yeah. X. It's a hard find. Wow. 
Yeah. That Can I point out it's out in me. even more fun play? Uh, uh -huh. Beth, uh, you you had, uh, when you played Faust, you had uh, fig warts for a triple triple. Oh my God. Which, did, when I played figs? Oh, wow. When, you, uh, when after Annette opened the triple triple spot with oil, do you had fig warts? As triple, 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 triple. I guess you're sure you checked that one, huh? Because I didn't see that. Oh, wow. I mean, no, right? Ooh. Somebody found I it in chat, so which is very funny. <laughs> yeah, so oh, I want to hone, chat. I want to zoom in for a second onto that play of Faust from both Beth and Annette's perspective. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't, I haven't studied my fives just because there's so many of them, and I don't think mm -hmm. either of you are fully through them either. So it seemed like no, a song No, I definitely play haven't, like, Studied, studied them, but it just. I looked think my weird. my issue I was know. I was thinking Faust, F R O W S T. Right. Oh. Yeah, and like and Faust, F O U S T is good. I've never seen it with the W. It just yeah. looked wrong. I don't know. It's really difficult to challenge a play like that because it's not a game deciding play. It's right. not like you need to challenge. So your initiative to challenge there shows a lot of word knowledge and confidence yeah it was a little bit of guessing too i certainly wasn't sure that it wasn't good but i just something in me told me it just looked wrong i don't know also annette plays more scrabble than i than anyone on earth i think um <laughs> so if she hasn't That's seen a official. word ever a five-letter word ever in her games before it she feels confident it's just not I, I mean, that's why I play her but... a lot, because I make up words so that she can never be too sure. Yeah, no, I love that. It's That makes it fun to play against you, because, like, I never know what you're going to play. <laughs> Village was a very pretty play up there. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I have a question. Did, is, is Unjoin good? Does anybody know? I don't think it's good. Um, yeah, I just don't want to play down to the end when I played Judo. I feel like Unjoined I had a lot of no plays good. that turn. Okay, you good. did have one like interesting play through the P. with judo. You had Judy once shifted over with dies and your, oh, which was just a couple more points. That it's hard to find better. though. Yeah, I wanted to get rid of the J and the Y, but I couldn't find the way to do it. But that definitely would have been it. Yeah, that was a small mistake. Um, hey, did I have a bingo? I, um, so I could have made funds at the bottom. I don't think so. No. no, retrial was your only like play. It. Oh, nice. that was yeah. it's a good find. How it quickly did you spot it. that retrial? Like how how much of that time was spent finding retrial, and how much of it was spent looking for other options? No, it was all spent finding retrial. I spent a lot of time looking fond and trying to think of a seven mm -hmm. that would work with that I. And when I realized right. I didn't know one. Then I looked up mm -hmm. at that spot, and there were a lot of bingos in that rack. But to end in an AL. Or right. I was looking also to end it in a AR, mm. like an EAR would have worked. Right, right. Mm -hmm. But, um, you know, because I prefer not to open up the triple lane, but that's right. all I saw. Yeah, I wanted to block that, but also with the Q, it's like if I don't play off the Q that turn, you know that I have it and you can block the yeah. spot that I had. So I kind of felt like I had to just hope that you didn't have any huge mm. plays. And I really saying. thought I had the game because I had that X, I had places mm -hmm. for the x played if yeah. i had just played ex would right. i have that's what i was expecting because i was looking in the bag i was like well she probably either has xi or ex unless yeah. the x is in the bag and then you didn't became play very it, close like, wow, right so at the lucky. end yeah um yeah yeah i just yeah i, I just want more time right yep no, Bet, time you played now. you bet you played extremely well it was just um uh the i think the luck went towards Annette a little bit more towards No, I think, yeah. I think Annette outplayed sure. rings around me. Mm, I don't know. Did yeah, I have a better I mean, bingo when I played Bombier? Did I have a anything to the E or through the A? There you was had, one... Um, yeah. I'm sure you know Ambaris. You had, yeah. Um, Ambaris is also right. good with an A in there as an H ah. to the double-double. Okay, yeah, I didn't see that. Did not see And that. Brian had another anything cool to the Latin e? word. Oh, yeah. Nothing to the oh, e. for, verbatim. Okay, good. It wasn't too bad then. Nice. Cool. All right. All right. Oh, thank, thank you. you. Have Brian, right and Brian up next, which should be very Ooh. fun. <laughs> He's like, oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it, Brian. 
Okay, it's the commentators from the Connecticut, the CFCs. All right, yes. We can make many Connecticut references that no one else will understand. <laughs> yeah. Uh, nutmeg. Ha-ha. <laughs> <laughs> Constitution State, am I right? Hilarious. Oh, insurance, insurance. <laughs> <laughs> I'm too young for that, unfortunately. Well, Uh-oh, it looks like they've hard. started. Have they sent the link? They did send the link. Um, okay, there we go. All right, so we're starting off with Annette again. I think she's gone first in all of her games. And um, she makes a quick jut, getting rid of a U and nice score. Mm -hmm. um, uh, Brian has the O to go underneath jut, which is nice, but unfortunately none of his tiles will follow a O or even go on top of an O. So he's no. going to be in an interesting sp situation here trying to figure out what to play, I think. I, I, and he doesn't have an E to make jute, jut into jute. I, mm -hmm. I mean, he could play dodo. Dodo is the best play according to the analyzer. The only other things you might consider are something like dodi, um, just getting through the T. Um, oh, yeah. Dodi I, meaning stained by decay. Oh, would you consider a trade here? I could imagine a trade. I think Dodo isn't terrible. CRY isn't a, that bad of a leaf. Um, I don't like Dodo because, oh, Dodie is good. I like that better than Dodo because Dodo would have left that triple lane very easy pickings. Sure. I think I think Dodie is the play here. Exchanging, I could imagine, um, but I think it would give Annette too much control. Like she can play anything under anything with Jute or anything under Jut. Yeah. Um, All right. Well, all right. the double M's. As of right now, there are just a couple nice plays that follow next to Doty, like Mom or More score a lot. Mom will also score well, um, but Jute was a nice play to find. And actually, um, Brian is going to find knows. himself with a bingo. Oh, yeah. Candor. Oh, no. Mm -hmm. That won't play, will it? It will oh, yes, it with will. MYC, the C, the MYC, which I always yes. miss. Yes. I think I've seen more professionals miss MYC than any other three-letter word. Now, Annette um, has Loriner, right? L-O-R-N-I-E-R. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, now, I don't like keeping the U there. It's a little bit hard to drop. There's a couple of, or this is going back to Brian's play. Right. There's a couple other plays like Duroc and Crudo. Um, that would get rid of it, but those are both strange words to know. Um, the best play is just another one of those cute overlap plays with Nerali, um, down to the double with Dawn and Mode. Um, but I could understand playing a couple less tiles and hoping for a bingo. I mean, Annette has a very nice rack here. Oh, she plays oh, that. Very she nice. She played it. Oh, no. Brian is cursed with the tile by the tile gods. Mm -hmm. I, he's still fighting with that U, and then to get three A's is tough. So I, the I best... definitely go mm -hmm. ahead. I think the best play is something cool like Guarani to the I because it cleans up the lack, rack a lot. And I might even go as far as to phony there with Guarani in, just because it looks good. And if you know Guarani, then it seems like a possible add-on. I would never challenge Guarani. <laughs> um, um, all right. So Annette has a very nice rack here, but I don't think she has any bingos. Don't see any sevens anyway, but what a pretty rack. I think I would. Mm -hmm. uh, these are hard racks for me because I hate to give up on any of them. I think I would play Crone at the bottom with a C on the double. With Agar. That's a Agar. nice play. Um, I, in times like these, I wish I knew my fives better to see if there's anything else that fits there. I don't see anything. Um, looking at the bot, the best play is an interesting hook. Everyone Ooh. knows Aeon, A-E-O-N, um, as a vowel dump, but you can actually add IC to that for Aeonic, which plays with Allah and G-I-E. That is really interesting. I did not know that. Me neither. Aeonic. Spell it again. A E I. A-E-O-N-I-C. 
Oh, that's, I, I might remember that. Thank you, Jeffrey. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I uh, think Hasty Bot. Thank um, you, Hasty. And then a couple other plays that could come down that just clean up her rack nicely. There's a play to the triple of either Recon or Rackon. Yeah. Um, and my personal favorite play, because I think it's very cute, is you can play Enemy to the MY with JO, which scores 21 points despite just playing ANO and keeps RICE, which is a pretty nice leaf. Oh, um, and, she plays and there crane. goes my crane. I do prefer crone to crane here, um, but both oh, I rack. love this rack. I know what's in it. There's two bingos. There's two. And I know one of them. Turbans. I love them both. Turbans and nut bars. Nut bars. Nut That's great. bars. I love that rack. Nut bars is one of the few nut-based words that isn't a phony. I mean, I've seen nut cake and nut, oh. nut other things as well, but nut bars is a great play. Um, does crane good? take an R is my question. Um, it does not. Don't, it does not, okay. Um, I didn't think so. I think he's gonna, if, if, if he sees the bingos, he's gonna have to play to mums or, oh, he could play to crane, but he won't be able to come down to the double word interesting so burst is the best non-bingo there oh. however turbans i think is a like you don't need to study that word and it's a crucial find there burst will score well and it will get rid of the bu um, it keeps a n which isn't terrible um but it is a, an unfortunate miss um well speaking of unfortunate i what are we going to see here <laughs> Yeah, there's not very much that Annette can be doing with this. Um, you think she'll make FOO down to the burst? It seems like one of the best plays to get something down. It's just so sad to leave IIFR on your rack. Um, I, I really hate it. Oh, Fro is interesting. Fro keeps her rack cleaner, mm. um, but still keeps II which I don't love. No, we're right. definitely going to see a bingo, will bingo. From, and from this rack. There's two here, both of which I like. These were my favorites back when I was studying the top 100 of Sinuate and Aunties. Sinuate like insinuate, but not in. And Aunties being the plural for Auntie. Um, there's a couple places for these to go. You can do Sinuate next to Fro with EF, or you can do Aunties underneath Bursts with Bursts. I think we'll probably see that come down. I think so. Like bursts of lightning. Mm -hmm. I was thinking for a second, does burst take an S because it's a past tense of... I was oh, thinking there's... that too. Those RST words often don't take an S. Yeah. Like, it sounds like a word that you would add a T to, like dripped or blent, right. you know, but it's not quite. He does drop sinuate next F, which scores probably decently well. The triple isn't helping you much there because it's only one point tiles. Um, and he's in first place. Yes, it will put him into the lead. Um, but Annette has a couple good comebacks with Fino. Um, she even has a bingo of Notify. Ah! Oh, wow! I don't think it plays anywhere. Unless you want to go for something like Bursty, which I would go for, but I understand why you wouldn't want to. Bursty plays. Yeah, is Bursty a word? I just word? checked it. Oh, wait, notify wow. is not a bingo. Sorry, I take it back. Oh. Uh, I don't well, know then. what letter we're doubling, but oh, yeah. notify is only six letters. Oh, there um, we go. Okay. It still would have been a cool play. Mm -hmm. um, and there are actually a couple plays there that might have been worth it, like Tien or T-I-Y-N underneath with Bursty. Yeah. I wonder if she knows Bursty, because that's a very important word to know in this, in this board. I'll tell you, I don't know any six letter words. <laughs> I study sevens, I study fives, I studied fours, threes, twos, That's I true. don't know seven. I don't know sixes. All right, so Brian finds himself with the Q and no place to play it. Wig is actually his best play, but it's sad to drop your only Y or your only I yeah. um, to score points. Now she still has that Y. I'm really interested to see if Bursty comes down. 
I think it would be a very powerful play. I think it's, it's just a good tile to have here. Oh. Onyx, that's a great find. Um, that scores a lot of points. That was really pretty. Mm -hmm. Ah, well, he's got a Q and a U. That's a rare beast in my book. It's always <laughs> either one or the yes. other. But I don't I see what he can if it do with plays. it. Yeah. Ugh, I would be uh, very frustrated with this whole situation. And yeah, I the would best be... play is actually to exchange here, but the I... tiles you're exchanging are very interesting. What tiles would you exchange in this position, I wonder? I would trade them all. Because trade them all? Both, both blanks are in the bag. That's I true. I would trade them all. The computer well, actually likes exchanging VLD, keeping Q-U-I-R, which I've seen a couple of the pros do, you know, and... Uh, mm. Mac Miller's games, he often will keep the keep R I Q U E or something because it has a lot of words. Um, however, I think a lot of this board is going to be shaped around that X on the bottom. If you can get some word to hit to the triple, that's a forty point play pretty easily. He, she's. Uh, I have no idea. This is going to be really interesting. What he does because I, I think have no Durex idea. is good, right? Do you oh, are... no, so if, if she can change like Q L I V U, like she can, and she draws a E, she'll have Redux to the triple, or sorry, he will, Brian will. He will, yeah. What did he? Um, what did what she does do? What he exchange? So I'm just looking at the game. It looks yeah. like he exchanged L Q U V. So he's keeping exactly the Redux rack. Okay. Um, it seems. Mump comes down, now, which is a nice hook. Now, he's got wedgier now, but I don't see a spot for it. Mm -hmm. um, and I don't see a, a something to that X, do you? My kingdom for an A, make rewax or something, but there's nothing there. It's going to be this something interesting. There's board. nothing that plays down. No bingos. Wedgie is the best play, um, according to the computer, at least. I'm not okay. sure that that's what I would go for here, though. I think opening the board is important a little bit, and it scores decently. But putting that E right next to the triple and the double seems a little bit risky. I agree, but I think it's going to work out for him because I think she's going to make detox across the bottom. Oh, interesting. Yes, that's a great play. If she um, makes detox, I, I don't see how she could put that H on that blue square over there on the left. Mm -hmm. I do know what you yeah, mean. I it think, was. Let's see. Right. White she could play. Oh, uh, and white is also a good play. Um, that's interesting. Oh my gosh. I wonder what the, what the calculation is there. I think white scores more. Yeah, white is better by six points. Um, and keeps O-D-E as opposed to H-I-E. And it yeah. also closes down that section. So I think that's probably the best play. She's um, very smart. If I, I were wonder, him, I would be gnashing my teeth over getting this Q. He's getting it back, right? And the V. Mm -hmm. When I see yeah. a play like white, I immediately start looking for extensions to it. Oh. Um, I just looked up a couple of real ones like non-white and bob white and anti-white, lint white. However, there's a lot of fake ones you could come up with as well that I could imagine going down. Um, is he going to exchange here? He did. That's interesting. That is actually, the he did do the best play exchanging QV. I mean, P-A-R-E-S is a very, very good leave. You have huge bingo chances right after that. Um, now, she's got that's surprising. an interesting rack going here. Mm-hmm. With the blank she's pulled and okay glows comes down i think that's a good play it doesn't open it up too much which is okay um and once again brian has himself a very good black and he needs to bingo now um unfortunately he doesn't have anything he has a very nice play of vena next to white which will score score 43 points um but nothing else Oh. Varex, Varex is good, but Varex is not, I think. Wow. So now... Wow. And that gets the unicorn 
where she gets and the Q and the, the U. Blank. Uh, and she's actually in an interesting situation here because she has both blanks and yet really can't do much with them. The Q and the U and the BGL are really close or slowing her down here. Yeah, I, I have, I'm, I'm at C. I have, I'm dying to see what she does. I'm on the edge of my seat because I, uh, I, I'm just trying to think of what you could do here. Um, I don't think there's any bingos. Nothing is going to come down. You can't really score well with a rack like that. Maybe it's worth it exchanging like QUB. Bod comes down. Bod is actually the best play here. Um, wow. Um, uh, oh, Eek okay. is a scary play. He's really trying to come back. He knows he needs to bingo, but I don't think that's the way to do it. You're just opening it up too much, and Annette's going to have a couple bingos here. Um, the most obvious one is uh, Qualia which I've seen before. It's still hard to find. And yes, she plays it, it. No, that's not a bingo though. Oh, it's not a bingo. Yes, that's true. But it scores just as much with the Q on the double and the triple. You're getting 74 points. Wow, there is the like bingo that... of Makila, but it's actually liked less despite scoring 30 points more. Wow. Okay, mm. so he's <laughs> does he have something through that E? This now game Annette is has, incredible. Yeah. Mm. Does she have any Annette. bingos? I don't think she will be going out, unfortunately. She drew all of the remaining vowels. All yeah. the vowels that Brian needed. Um and then I think at this point you just play whatever you can to get rid of vowels, you know. Um all those oh no, never mind. Um Oh, there's actually an incredible play here. Um, Annette could have played Ox Eye with Bursty to the triple. O X E Y E using the that blank as a Y. We forgot That's about a that. Very book. hard find. Wow. That would have been um, cool. Opa is a great play, though. It scores many points. Um, the other options were like Kwai. Um, oh, there's another really cool one. I just studied this of ice wine, E I S W E I N. Oh, we have a typo. Opa. oh yeah. Uh -oh. Ice wine has an anagram too. Is it going to stay on the board? Looks That's like. funny. I think, I think they're just fooling around right now. Um, Annette and Brian are really good friends, <laughs> and I can't wait to see what they say about this game. <laughs> Got to win the pony. Hey guys, Brian good job. Is, I'm proud of you. Brian here. is actually showing off his. Me <laughs> pretending like I didn't see that at all. <laughs> <laughs> Brian showing off his far superior skill at the end with an incredible word knowledge of QLAS. Yeah. It extends beyond our dictionary into what many would consider made up words. I definitely um, have to review my fours. <laughs> so that was a great game. Do you guys have any initial thoughts? Um, let's and see. That good. That was... Bones of <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I feel like with the spot where I played Bod, what the hell am I supposed to do there? Bod was actually the best play. It was a really yeah. tough situation. Was it really? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I really I wanted wait to play to off my Q. I couldn't, I couldn't find a way to like burn a blank and to score points with it. So I was like, yeah. oh, fuck it. I'm just going to try to bingo with my Q instead. Um, and yeah, you I didn't bingo, but you scored just as much. Yeah, I mean, I might have had bingos there. But as soon as I saw Qualia, I'm like, that's just as good as bingoing. It was a great play. Um, and then I just got greedy by playing Abe. I was like, I'll try to bingo out. <laughs> Now, did you both know the hooks to burst? Uh, burst does it actually take a takes y? A, It does take a Y. Bursty. Oh, okay. bursty I, I was not sure of that. I saw it, but I was like, I'm not confident enough to play You that. held on to the Y for a long time, so it seemed like that might be a great play. Onyx yeah, is great. Yeah, no, I just, I just couldn't find a way to really get rid of it and score points. Mm -hmm. Unless um, you guys saw wanna, any better plays that I missed. I, I just want to point out one play right at the end. It wouldn't have mattered at all, but just mm -hmm. to see your reactions. With your rack, just so you know, Brian, in the very last play, first of all, she had both blanks when she played Qualia. Um, mm -hmm. And she played off and she managed to draw six vowels with her blank. Um, <laughs> so Opa was a great play. It scores a couple. But you actually had mm -hmm. the 43-point play of Ox Eye using the blank as a oh, Y, wow. hoping to bursty in the wow. bottom right, which I think is just an incredible word. And yeah, Brian, if, I, if I were you, I would have just been gnashing my teeth and tearing my hair. You had a <laughs> yeah, lot. Yeah, you must have had some bad racks there. Rod. 
Ah, yeah. I mean, when you exchange two times in like three turns, that's when you know. Yeah. It was it was bad. Yeah. It was it was really it was ominous. Like like I said, yeah. drawing well is a skill, and I'm not as yeah. skillful as you guys. So I have the skills. Yeah. You know, we got to work on that. <laughs> yeah, you got to put that I... word studying aside and just work on drawing better. Yeah. Mm -hmm. well, I, mean, I think that is I, my uh... best skill is drawing. Um, I can give you, you some you, pointers you if you want. You are pretty good at that, Jeffrey. I'll give you that. You're pretty good at drawing. That's my well, specialty. Mm -hmm. um, but well, it was we'll a well-played game. I guess <laughs> next Beth will be the Battle, Battle of Connecticut. Connecticut. Battle of Connecticut, yes. indeed. Oh. You and me, Brian. Let's do this. All right. I'm going to head right. out. All right. I will pull you guys up as soon as you start. This should be a fun matchup. I don't think I've ever seen these two play before. Let's see. No, and they um, are off. Oh, so, okay. So we have to go to... I already did it. I got it. Oh, uh, there's one. Okay. Yeah. So I think, uh, again, um, I'll be using this analyzer as a crutch some more while you take yeah, it. Yeah, go ahead and pull it up. Yeah. Yeah, I don't have their games up. I just look at the stream. So I will ask oh, you if I don't know words. <laughs> Can somebody put the link in? I did. That, that's I'm our just game. waiting for Josh to. Oh, sorry about that. Sorry about uh, Sorry, that. everyone. Um, they haven't played the anything stuff, yet, so we're fine. OK, okay I got it. Up. Yeah. Ooh. Uh, exactly Beth. Got it. Oof, I think I would exchange here. Yeah. I don't think it's worth playing QI. It's such a terrible leap. Oh, well. Yeah, I mean, I guess if you want the points. Uh, Equity says virals was um, was the best play you could make, and then the yeah, next I disagree with that. To exchange, well, just yeah. equity wise. Um, yeah, I, I would never play virals in that spot. That seems bad. We have some. Um, so what are we play, doing here? Ever play the queue on the first turn for less than twenty six points? <laughs> popular theory out there. Yeah. Never play QI. <laughs> Basically. What do you? So what are you seeing here? Um, for... I'm thinking just something like Jin, maybe underlapping QI. Zing looks fine. I might have hold on to that Z, try to score more points with it. But that seems fine mm. too. It's obviously more defensive. Yeah. What's see, this is the problem with playing QI on the first turn. It's like you're so often going to be exanging on on the second move, which seems that like the right thing to do. What you should do here. It's just a matter yeah. of which letters. Right. So maybe something like Zowie. Mm, don't really love that. <sighs> Dowie maybe with Din. I don't really see anything great. Zowie, Zowie is the best underneath the Zing. Them, okay. Yeah. That seems Zowie. fine. Owie is Owie the under the G, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's what we, that looks yeah. fine. That's a good good rack. Oh, Annette. Annette, do you see any bingos here? I mean, re echoes, I'm pretty sure it's good. Re chos. Coheres. Chiros, I think oh. is good. Churros. <laughs> uh yes. Uh, Actually, maybe re echoes yeah. isn't good. It's only re echo and it doesn't take an S, if I remember correctly. So she has a few 100 point plays um, hitting a double double. Under so Chiros would be good, right? C H E R O S. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Coheres and Chigos. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Cohesive um, through the eye is. Oh, cohesive close. is good too. Yeah. Findable play for mortals. Definitely. Cheerios, lots of yeah, Jonathan. Oh, Cheerios, I love that. Yeah, another double double. Yeah, should be able to find a bingo here, I would hope. Yes, indeed. It's tough though under know. under time pressure. And these are if pretty you, short. If you games think I'm too. adorable and you like my mustache, please hit the subscribe button. I promise. <laughs> to come back Oh, yeah, well, it would be very the, much appreciated if you guys subscribe to the channel. Oh my gosh, it's just, <laughs> I can't even, can't 
can't even keep up with how high this number is climbing right now. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for watching. I don't actually have the chat up. Maybe I'll do that. I keep forgetting to do that when I'm commentating. Oh, well, they're only talking Have you been about looking at chat at all? <laughs> yeah. I mean, of course, you're way more important. Yeah, it's mostly... Let's see if I can actually get this up. Okay. Mm. Okay, so they're saying re echoes is good, but it needs to E. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, she doesn't. I feel like I've fallen over that before. She doesn't play it two spots. To ah, the she or... missed the gore spot. Oh, man. Ah, that's too bad. I think fatigue might be setting um, in. Uh, yeah, maybe. A couple hours. Is there a bingo here? That's a good question. No, I can't there's... imagine, like, Smiley being good. <laughs> There's a nice definitely bingos with an S, but uh, the butt best plays were some under what happened there? Under cheeros. Uh, it looks like what did I miss? Wait. What happened? Did she exchange? No, I'm uh, cheeros was challenged. Confused. Oh, 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 okay, okay, that makes way more sense. I see. Um, okay, um, so this is a terrible rack. That's unfortunate. It's hard to is challenge this be an knowing. Change here. It's hard to challenge there knowing that she had so many options, you know. Right. Rack. Yeah, but like um, I've experienced really a lot that like even even though you see other bingos in the rack doesn't mean your opponent does because if they did they would have played something yes. they were sure of, right? Yes, I've I've definitely been. Like obviously they were sure of it, but yeah. But like I have um, that happen with my clubmates all the time. Like they'll have a rack and I see. 20 other bingos and then the word that they played i'm not sure of and i'm like i don't know if this is a word but then when you think to yourself okay well they had so many other bingos i'm gonna let it go and ends up being a phony and it's like damn that was just the first thing they saw yeah. so they played it <laughs> yeah. it really just depends Same on who you're playing against in that spot you really gotta know your opponents so i don't know what i would do here probably exchange it's just so bad with that wu I don't know if I would keep two U's there. I mean, it's a lot of points. It's it's close. Uh, she plays Aub for thirty two. Yeah, yeah. Like, it's it's a lot of points, but like next turn points. is gonna be rough. Yeah, it's probably okay. I might have exchanged. So now we have the same spot again, pretty much. Now what do we do? um is there anything down from that oh maybe like oiled just to open the board a little bit doesn't score a lot of points though um something like it and wed opens the lane underneath even it's if you want to chuck on the s it's a lot of points yeah that's the best equity play yeah i mean there, there are options yeah yeah, I feel like I probably wouldn't play it though, just because when you are down this many points, you don't want to help your opponent close the board. By playing it, you're setting up your S with Weds. It might be a little bit better. True, true. And, and then there's Aoi over on the right. He so that. he does go with the highest equity play, and now we're back to two U's, which, I mean, this was going to happen. Keeping two U's, you're still going to have two U's in the next turn. <laughs> yep. So now do we exchange? Do we play something like FUB to set up the S? I don't know. I don't know what I would do here. That's, I would be very sad. Oh, oofies. Oofies, that's, that's probably fine. Yeah. I don't know if I would burn the S there, though. I, just, I really, I love my S's. I don't just give them up easily. Maybe I keep them a little bit too long sometimes. She is still clean at this point up by 60. Yeah. So is apply a word? Probably not. Sorry, what, what are we looking at? I was looking at apply, U-P-L-I-E, but that might not be a word. Those are so hard. Don't know about that. Yeah, I don't know about that either. Um, so what else can we do here? I'd like to get rid of some of those E's. Not seeing any great ways to do that. Maybe just like peak. Peak so looks okay. Maybe a, good play would, maybe a good play would be something like climb. Um, 
forming lids and also opening up a triple triple spot so see it's quite a bit behind where are you, you seeing this mean? um uh from the sea and chiros coming down something like climb or oh i see yeah that might be a little risky um, <laughs> i play p what is this yeah i know <sighs> Um, any bangles here? Probably not. Oxter, probably Oxter fine. There's enough Using points that it's worth burning the blank. Oh, she misses Oxbow, though. Huh? Or Oxbow would have been better play. Oh, uh, that would be nice. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. O-X-B-O-W. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. uh, she probably knows that word, but it's hard to... Yeah, that's a tough one to see. That. So, are there any bingos here? I don't see anything. So then uh, what? No bingo. Yeah. Climb again is the best so. equity. Now it's not so risky. Well, it's, it's, it is. Right. Risky. Yeah. A weird way to heal them, forming mm -hmm. uh, Epe. Mm -hmm. Mike, or similar. In right. the same spot, but similar on a point. Yeah, it doesn't really have any great options here. It would be nice to yeah, find a way to like play through that UP, but I don't think there are any good options. Um. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Hips isn't good, she... right? Is hips good? Oh, hits. Uh. Yeah. I don't think so. I don't like hits. That is yeah, indeed. It might stay though. If it stays on the board, it's clearly the best play. <laughs> of course. <laughs> well, this, well, despite the climb. Uh, no, for the reasons we were saying, climb is too risky. So, and since this pony is kind of close to that idea, yeah. This, this so, is the best Shika play. is Shika good, play. right? Sorry? Shika is good. So maybe if I would she lets so. this stay, she would play something down there. Don't see any great plays with that, though. Maybe just Oba. Shiko, okay. True. Or Chico. About that. Yeah, that's nice, too. So maybe she wasn't sure if hits was good and she was like, well, I have a good play. I'm just going to leave it. I mean, uh, which seems I, fine uh, when you're up that many points. If you can still stay up by 110, it might be worth just not challenging there. Chat here. Uh -huh. So again, trying to look through that UP, I don't see anything through that UP this turn either. What is the examiner saying uh, in this spot? Oh, sorry, I was just kidding. I don't see I any good options. Yeah. Uh, elf. <laughs> she elf. For 14. Elf. Yeah. That's the best play. That's great. Yeah. Don't you um, love that? It's terrible. Yeah, especially Man. when you're down by this much. Oof. Yeah, that's definitely not what you want to play. Uh, maybe something like sled making peel. Set up an S hook you don't have. I don't know. I'd be pretty desperate at this point to try to open the board a little bit. I'm seeing our producer in chat is saying that uh, our likes have doubled from 5 to 10 and uh, the analytics say that it's uh, mostly due to my mustache. I don't know how he has that data that he can tell what causes the likes, but but indeed, if it's right there, it says that my That's clearly is why. Responsible for- It's definitely the mustache. The Let's see if we can triple that. <laughs> so place M trying to set up a lane. That seems, I guess, fine. Uh, didn't really help. I guess something like Fjeld with F-E-M-E. -E. What's the origin of that word? <laughs> oh, you'd like to know, wouldn't you? Oh, and he <laughs> missed it. That's kind of a tough word to see, though. 
I mean, Hefe probably Indeed. scores more points, but Fjeld is definitely the content play. <laughs> <laughs> the style play. Get a Norwegian word. So here we definitely have some scoring plays. First thing I see is just like Oma. There's probably something better. Didn't want oh, yeah. to put That's on the oh. Not... Yeah, probably just didn't see it. I mean that's too yeah, many points like I'd like to give up. Yeah. Mol Mola. Mm-hmm. Um continue with our geographical theme um the best way here is alp on top nice of... oh. yeah <laughs> that looks pretty good it doesn't help open the board at all though that would be my only kind of drawback there like if you're gonna play with a gin i'd like to move it one to the left just so we can open a bingo lane <sighs> is that a word don't know if I'm capable of that, Jared. Sorry. I don't know if that's a word. I might challenge that. That's a word. It is a word. Our ball. Is, do we know the meaning of that? that uh, click on it. How do it looks is, good? It is pertaining to plowed land. So things involving the earth. Uh, we're, we're getting good a, to know. Good to know. We, Things involving I would know all about that. Limited. <laughs> Pudgy. Oil comes down to block oh, 40 that lane. Points. Yeah. So Jeffrey is clawing his way back into this game, but still down quite a bit. But the board is more open Running now. So. Yeah, I mean, he's a good blitz player. I wouldn't count him out quite yet. He definitely knows how to play fast when he needs to. But Looks since, he, as he said, he's, he's growing older, he might be losing those speeds. <laughs> I mean, I definitely find if I don't play Blizz for a while, I feel like I get rusty real fast. Speaking of rusty, is he in the room? Uh, uh, is he here? Cat? Yeah. yeah. We he's... would like to say hello to Russ. Russ is Brian's cat. He is very, very cute. Oh, yeah. there he is, Rusty boy. Hi, Russ. Hi, pee pee. Oh, hi. He hears you. Oh, oh he's so cute. Can I come say hi? Ah, oh. Devoir. I don't. More know likes, everybody. Word. More likes and subscribers. Russ says. I would challenge Please this too because I have no words. <laughs> hi, Russ. Oh, baby. Oh, he likes it. I mean, obviously, cat content is way more interesting than Scrabble. Yeah, I don't know. I happening could look at Russ now? all day. Uh, I think Jeffrey just phonied, but I could be wrong. Oh, Russ, what do you think? What a cutie. Yeah, he phonied. So, do we have anything That's interesting happening? Huh? It would be hard to tell. I would challenge that, that just because it's Jeffrey. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, God. I know the him. I everywhere. know what he's up to. So maybe something like Tuba in the top left. Score some points. Best terrible leave. Yeah, terrible leave, though. Best but we like points. But points are good. She's, she maintain a she's winning, point. but not by that much. And I'm sure she yeah, wants to try to do something team. about that lane on top of Bide, which is kind of hard to do. It's an interesting play. I guess it somewhat obstructs that okay. lane a little bit. Yeah. Is that a word? What? No. I don't like it. It is, actually. It, it is, is a word? Wow. Mm -hmm. See, that's the thing about Jeffrey. Like, he knows a lot of words, but he also makes up a lot of words. Mm -hmm. Which makes it very tough to play against. Does that word he just played take an S? If you have it up. Yes? It's a noun. Yeah, it does. Ah, okay. Never seen it.
So this game is pretty much over. We'll see a way in which Jeffrey can win. There's no bingo in that, right? Oof, no sixes, but that's it. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, he got close. Oh, he found his. <laughs> oh, but that doesn't play. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's a funny good challenge. I mean, yeah. fourth challenge. I mean, good try. Yeah, of course. I totally missed Aaron's there. Ranters, too, but that doesn't play. Um... Maybe this guy will so bring some So, can she go out anywhere? Yeah. yeah. Yep, that was a close, kind of close game in the end, but not. Yeah, good job to Jeffrey. Not quite there. Back. Yeah, he almost made a good comeback there. All right, so Beth wins, maintains that early lead, three sixty-two yep. to three thirty-two. Yep, well good done. Game. Playing some good defense there. Good job. Nice win. Hey. We have a, we have a commentator, everybody. Nice wow. phony there by uh, <laughs> the phonier yeah, I himself. I saw Aaron's and Ranters, uh, but I thought I had yeah. blocked it. And when it came yeah. down, I was like, oh. You were like, shit. But then you're like, oh, wait. Oh. <laughs> and I was blocking up anything I could. Yeah, no, you did a good job on that. Oh, Devoir, oh, nice. that's a good phony. Appreciated that. <laughs> I've done it so many times, and I his was accidental. I oh, I know okay. that word. I yeah, we were like, that. huh? Is that a word? Wait, where uh, is his? I, his? I didn't. When realize. he played chic, <laughs> we both know that's not a word. Everyone knows that's not a word. Yeah. Um, I missed that. We thought maybe you were like, well, I have a good comeback. I'm not going to challenge. I just have in case. To say it was more along the lines of, ooh, juicy spot for me. Right, but exactly. I didn't look. Yeah. Is, that yeah, yeah. Took a is that good? Yeah, Chica? Chica was good. Pretty sure Chica is good yep. too. Yeah. yeah. Um, by it, I, I did not know non ain non a new is, word to me. non a classic Aerolith for me. I've seen that there a couple of times. Ah, uh, okay. See, I don't do Aerolith, so that makes sense. Uh, I was like, I probably yeah. challenged that. <laughs> I had no wins, what, right? Jeffrey, what is so. Aerolith? <laughs> what, yeah, would you I mean, like to explain, explain to the viewers what Aerolith, what Aerolith is? is? In case, yeah, right. I mean, in case we have newer players. Here. Oh, Aerolith is a study platform where it gives you fifty random words. Um, so through that, you can see a lot of words, and I don't remember most of them. But words, and that it gives like you words to solve. So they have daily challenges and stuff like that. If you want to go through some threes or fours or fives or try to learn the sevens, sixes, sevens, whatever it is that you want, it's a and good it's place fine. to just learn that how to anagram. Sense. Yeah. What's the site? Aerolith dot what? Dot org. Yeah. So Devoirer? What the hell is that? I, not a word. De it's a made up a word. word. <laughs> yeah. Devoir is a word, and I I was gonna play terroir. It's very creative. I had three or four R's at that point, so I was gonna play terroir, <laughs> and then you played Dev yeah. there blocking that, so I was like, okay, I'll take it, and then I <laughs> phoned it again. <laughs> yeah, very um, nice. We we appreciate your phonies. They're fun. Did I miss any like high scoring plays earlier on? Um, I didn't have the examiner up, so I don't know for sure. Maybe Brian would know. No, I don't remember. But I I don't uh, think so. It, it seems like you're. It seemed like you played well. fine. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I was surprised you didn't block when I made the obvious fem hook. Yeah, um, how are you going to block that? With Upo without or opening a triple. Huh? With Upo. With Upo? Yeah, but is it really worth blocking that lane? It's really not that big of a, a bingo lane. I think if you play like... I mean, it can be, but is it really you worth have sacrificing the block? Other, any other consonant that goes... Like, I'm playing that you know I have the E. Um, yeah, of course you have the E, but like even if you bingo on that lane, you're opening up a triple lane. So sure. like, it's not that big of a deal to block it. I was wondering if it was worth it to not play Hefe there and to instead play Fjeld, F J E L D. Yeah, I was I was thinking about Fjeld there. Um, it's just I think like that might have been a little better. Less points. So yeah, it's less old. points, but Hefe gives back a lot. What I don't think we've mentioned yet is, you know, and what is a big part of the game is the challenge aspect, the, the challenge mm -hmm. of Chiros, you know. Right. Uh, 
That was bad. At that at that moment, you had um, a thirty six point play underneath of Isles, underlapping it. So um, yeah, I didn't. Especially if you have a comeback. Yeah, like what that. were what was your thought process when you challenged there? Um, she took also Beth. Long... Sorry, but you should have put that a couple spaces to the right. Right, you could have right. played it as a double double with Gore. I couldn't. G O R. I... G O R. Oh yeah, that would have yeah, worked. Yeah, just Burn same it. word. Yeah. You oh, know, I kept. Yeah, yeah. I yeah, know you, you had a couple of options. There was there's Chiros, there's Reachus, yeah. there's Echoers, yeah. and I kept looking to there's... try to get it over, and unbelievably, right. I think I forgot G O R. But yeah, yeah, Jeffrey yeah. had a better play there. Cheerios to the right. Yeah, that also would have worked. I've never seen. For some reason, I've never seen Cheerios. I've only seen mm -hmm. Cheerios, and I thought right. she took a long time. Oh, wait a second. Maybe she mistook Cheerios. Right. Um, yeah. Which I, I don't know. I I just like, it's just a weird word to not know. Right. But we were also saying, like, you probably know that there are other bingos in that rack. So, like, would that have affected your thought process if you saw the other bingos? Would you maybe not have challenged? Or yeah. So if I because those spots are really interesting. If I thought or used my brain, that would be a good process to have used. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I feel like in those spots is like so dependent on your opponent and like knowing how your opponents play if they're the kind of person who will just like play the first thing they see that they think is a word or they go through all of them. Because I have some club mates that will just like play the first thing they see, even though there's clearly like better options in that rack. Sometimes I get into the habit of like doing what you guys did and being like, okay, well, I'm going to challenge this time. Or like other times I'll be like, I know there are so many bingos there, so I'm not going to challenge you even if I don't think it's a word. Like it's a tough balance to kind of find. If I had thought about it for a second longer, I would have realized that. I mean, it's just – it really looks bad to me. Like it does not mm -hmm. look like a real word. I mean, it if you don't think it's a word, you don't think it's a word, right? Yeah. Um, yeah. I should have known. But you played very well. Koofies came down, which was nice. About was mm -hmm. sad. Um, yeah, we have a question here in the chat. Um, if you would like to tell the story behind your shirt, Jeff. Yes, I heard that Art is in the chat. <laughs> uh, I think I met Art for the first time just a little bit ago. Um, but I have a collection of Scrabble clothes. Here, let me let me see if I can pull out some of it. I have a collection of Scrabble clothing that I've been gathering over the years. I just wore my Scrabble oh, socks. Love to see them. <laughs> I have mm, everything's in the wash, unfortunately. But I have a Scrabble. I button. love how committed you are. Can I just say that? I have Scrabble pajama <laughs> pants. I have Scrabble. I have Scrabble. Everything. I've seen the pajamas. Yeah, they're awesome. <laughs> my dream was to get a nice Scrabble thing that I could wear that it doesn't necessarily seem like it's scrabble until you realize that it <laughs> but is. when you get close uh, and i saw yeah. art was in charge of the las vegas double down tournament and he had this shirt and if you look close all of these little spots are scrabble tiles and i thought that was the most incredible thing so i chased That's him so down awesome. and him for days to get me the brand that made it um and i found it and i went to that brand's website and they didn't have it anymore so i emailed the company I emailed their PR rep and was like, hey, do you have any of these in storage? And they said, I'm sorry, that was in our issue from three years ago in the summer issue of clothes. Um, and so I searched the internet until I found a copy on Poshmark. And now I have it because it is such a good shirt. It doesn't fit That's me. That's so cool. But it's so cool. It's, um, it's and awesome. I really cool. Thank yeah. Art very much for having the shirt and helping me get it. And we appreciate it very much. It's fun to look at. Mm-hmm. Oh, standing. All right, so I don't think I'm Great. three and oh, I lost my first game to Jeffrey. That needs to be changed. Yeah, I think my Jeffrey's phone is a lot in the end. Like they brought me back to within not losing by 100. Yeah, I really mm -hmm. blew it on challenging you. Yeah, you saved some spread there in the end for sure. And yeah. you knew during my commentary that I phony a lot. I did. <laughs> <Yeah>. Well, <laughs> Hey, the one that really counted was D E L A that I got yeah. you know, that I challenged. That I was I, Yeah. That, that would have been catastrophic. I was eighty percent sure wasn't good, but it was a win or a not win. Sure. So oh I, yeah. I think I'd have win any other way. D E L E. If any of you are enjoying the stream so far, we would very much appreciate if you subscribe to the channel, give it a like, you know, all that YouTube yeah. stuff. 
because that way we might do more of these in the future. <laughs> so what are we doing next? I think we're recalculating what our standings are like. And then two matches. And then we to will go. see. Yeah. I'm guessing then... it will probably be me and Jeffrey, maybe. I'm not sure. I yeah, so we have two more games to go. I'll tell you, All at right, a tournament, we'll... I'm just obsessively looking at my wins and losses every second. <laughs> I wish I had. I wouldn't any sweat wins it if I were you. <laughs> I'd love to be able to say I, I'm looking at wins and losses. But... <laughs> <laughs> well, well, no one I is really, undefeated. I've rarely seen anyone pull so bad as you pulled in three the games. game against me. Yeah. Oh, the game against me. Mm -hmm. It was yeah, horrible. I've been drawing pretty poorly. That's what I'm saying. You need to just draw better. It's not I, about knowing the I, words. It's about... I know. Doing good tiles so you can play the words, you know? I need to be better at cheating. Yeah, you do. That also is helpful. <laughs> yeah. Um, one of my favorite stories. Not everyone can have letters up their sleeves. <clears throat> <laughs> All right, so it looks like the standings are, are up. And it's probably going to be. Okay, so me and Brian are going to play first, Yay. I think. And then Jeffrey and Beth. Wonderful. So, Exciting. We Rematch. should just get going. Rematch. Are you ready, Brian? Brian? Okay. Are you ready? All right. I need one minute to go grab my headphone cord, which I appear to have Okay, dropped. don't. I'll be right back. Okay, I guess you can start. Beth, Beth can start. That's fine. I can start. Yeah, you're fine. All right. And you're setting up the game? Yep. I matched you, Brian. Okay. And what you've got the... You can I you will put send the... it to you right Wait. now. Right. And it looks like it's going to be a net first. And there is the board. Now, those are... Some kind of, oh, what happened? There was a trade there? I guess my headphone cord is gone forever, but that's okay. Um, oh, that was interesting in the, okay, I can see that. Um, there are some interesting plays going on here. He has, ooh, things just changed. Do you exchange? Yes, Brian exchanged and then I, Silvern is going to come down. Silvern. Um, I would have, I was going to mention with uh, Brian's rack, he had M-I-A-O-U, which is one of those nice vowel dumps oh. that would have gotten the M on the double and cleaned up his rack pretty nicely. Oh. Um, and it's a cat word, which I like. Mm-hmm. Meow. 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 Um, meow. So... <laughs> All right, what is um, Brian going to have here? I don't see anything, but I feel like there must be something in here. He um, almost has Twasome, T-W-A-S-O-M-E. Oh, he has but... some nice, he has some nice eights that are through either the R or the N because the blank will replace either the N or the R in each case. Um, Interesting. He has the nice bingo of Waterman which ah. is a pretty reasonable play. I think you can intuit it pretty well. Um, I assume that's somebody with water. Mm -hmm. um, it's, a, it's a hard play to find, but I always look for um, M-A-N whenever I have the M-A, just because so many plays come with it. Um, I think it's always something good to spot, to look for. All right, Wayne is going to come down, down, and that's no good, that's unfortunately. That's no good. And I think Annette is going to immediately take that off, unless we have another QLAS situation. Yeah, <laughs> there it goes. And she's oh, got... she's going to oh, pass. She's a very good sport. No, she passed back as a very good sport. Oh, must oh that was very nice. Yes. I think it was a typo. 
Um, I think it was. Obviously, they're good sports. They're very nice friends. That was um, very nice. Now she has indole. So it and seems like we have a couple beginners coming in here. Um, basically what you want to go for in a game like this is you're trying to get the bingos and those come with the common tiles. Common letters like E and N and D always work together well and you can generally find words in it. So with a blank, Annette is gonna come with a couple of words. She had indoles to silverns, but she's gonna find, I think her highest scoring one of a loined. Actually, I think she had a higher one of entoiled um, just to get the O on the double letter rather than the G, but aloined is the second best fly. Um, and Ryan is going to be able to bingo back, I think. Um, he has plays like enframed, should score very nicely. Um, now, is farm man a good word or is it just farmer? I don't, I don't like farm man. Um, but fireman think. should be good. Oh, yes. Um, unfortunately, I don't think there's a good place on the board for it. Um, it's an interesting situation. There's honestly not too many bingos that aren't eights, and eights are very hard to find. Um, there are a lot of eights, though. So I'm just going to read down the list of ones that are here. There's N framed with an E, unframed with a U. Um, four name, uh, rifleman, inflamer, fragment. So there's a lot here, but it's really hard to find. I think finding one of those M A N words is going to be very key. And he finds in frame. That's a great play. Excellent. Um, that's terrific. And that's a 92 point bingo. Nothing wrong with that. Mm -hmm. Hey. And Cherish, or I mean, uh, and I actually has the bingo here of opaqued. I'm actually not sure if it's a verb. I don't I, like opaqued. I would play opaqued in a second. But it is good. <laughs> hmm? It is good. Opaqued does play. I, um, I would have challenged opaqued, so it's a good thing it didn't get played against me. Hmm. Um, is there um, a place for opaqued? There unfortunately is not. But she does uh, have the Q, which is going to help with the Q here. And there's a lot of yeah. good places for words. Something like peaked would be nice um, sure. through the I. Quad is the other nice fly. Um, OK, and Brian has the J. And he actually says some really nice plays with it. He has like Haji underneath quad. I think that's a Middle Eastern oh, thing. Oh, yes. Um, He's very close to like a couple of bingos, but not quite. I think Haji is just going to be the best play. It scores nearly 40 points, keeps RET on your rack. You can't hope for better than that. Um, yeah. A Haji is the person who makes Hodges. Oh, wow. All right. Jin is going to come down, which is an okay play. It keeps uh, H-A-T-E-R, which is a nice leave. Yeah, terrific leave. But... Um... Hmm. Ovias oh, is a very nice find here. Okay. Um, it gets rid of a lot of her tiles. It keeps a P, which isn't perfect, but I think for this points that she's getting and for keeping the game going, it's pretty good. Um, and nice, Brian is going to come out with hardier through the E. Terrific. Um, very nice play. He also had something like, oh no, never mind. I was going to say he had in gather, but not quite. Um, hardier and earthier, um, he finds the best play. Now, Annette actually has an eight-letter bingo here, a real word, if you can find it. I love the way um, you say real words, not your words. Definitely. I think there's a big difference. I love when I'm with friends and I say, oh, that's a Scrabble word, you know, when we were reading. Oh, I see what you're book. saying. Um, but well, conspire, conspire comes down, which is the is only bingo. Very terrific. nice thing. Um, Just beautiful. I love the idea of Scrabble words, you know, words that are basically only useful for Scrabble players. Yeah. I think they're just as valid, but should be classified with the asterisk of Scrabble word. Um, now, this is a tough situation for Brian because he's nowhere near a bingo. He's close to a couple things if he can get the right tiles out. And that's actually very nice. He plays egg ear, um, getting egg, pretty good. 
Hmm. And then Annette has got the Z. I don't, I, I actually don't see any. Oh, yeah. Dory, that's, that's a great find. That's taking yeah. the Haji spot from before and scoring a couple of points it. more with a Z. Um, I think that is going to be her best play. Actually, it's interesting. She could have scored more points with just zit in the top left. Um, really? Maybe she wanted no. to get rid of the O, but um, zit up top is nice. And even zitty underneath there, ZD as in, I oh, think, yeah, the yeah. dish with quad yeah. and ute um, would have scored just as many points and uh, kept a little bit of a letter to leave, I well, think. I see that Brian has the seven loose sight, but... Mm -hmm. I don't see an eight. Um, yeah, there is none that play. Okay. Um, his best bet right now is loose um, to L U C E to the triple, but cause makes sense. It's going well. It's getting rid of the U and the C, just trying to relieve his black rack a little bit. In a point like this, though, it's a little bit complicated because the board is pretty closed down. The J and the C are doing well at making it so you can't get any nice sevens down over there. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, the only real only... place to bingo. The only real place to bingo is with an eight or to gin, which now gets blocked by a net. Right, and that was yeah. Hmm. Okay, um, I think we're gonna see bice go down. B i c e. Yes, bice scores very well here. And that opens up the board a tad, very tad. Mm -hmm. It'll give an e to get to the triple maybe for a bingo. Um, it is a strange four to know, though, so I wouldn't be surprised if it doesn't get played. Maybe like a play like Vibe. I mean, it scores less, but it's a similar sort of position where it gets rid of the same tiles and it scores okay. Beige is interesting. Beige is going even more for that bingo, just trying yes. to get rid of his tiles. Um, I'm just trying to see if Annette has something very strong here. Like she has, comes an, down. she has an A B L and there is an E on the board. I always look for those able words. Mm -hmm. But she, and ably especially. Right. Oh, but, she has a very interesting play, a six letter word of Timbal, T Y M B A L. I think that's an alternate spelling of Timbal with an I. Um, and that would get the Y on the triple letter score and the L on the double word score and score forty two points. That would be very pretty. Um, in fact, there's a lot of really pretty plays on the board right now. Another one is Maist, M-A-Y-S-T, in Conspire. That scores oh, yes. 30. Um, and another pretty play would be Iamp, to the I in Aloint, with Dag and M-I, as in in the notes in Do, Re, Mi, and then B. But Matt comes down, which scores pretty well, and it closes down the board a lot more, which I think is exactly what Annette likes to do. She's up yeah. now. All she needs to do is make sure that um, Brian can't drop down a bingo. Now, three, four, five, six, seven. There also, of course, is that left lane to that bottom E for a bingo. Oh, I haven't even looked there. Yes, that could come in key. That Unfortunately, in key. Brian still doesn't have a bingo. His best bet, again, is to just play off a couple tiles to that C with Unco, U-N-C-O. It's a nice play that would drop his U and his O and his N. And Lest is a very nice leave here. Um, yeah. It's hard to find, though. U-N up top is fine on its own. It's very risky. But maybe that's what Brian needs right now is just something risky to get back into it. Anything through that V up top now? I don't know. Oh, there comes Mun. Mun there. That's interesting. It's a few less points than UN in exactly the same spot, but going down. Uh, but it's a little bit safer, which I understand. Um, but Annette drew the X with some nice supporting tiles. Beautiful, um, yeah. Even something like Vox would close down the board a lot, but I'm sure she's going to find something even better. I, I don't hate Vox. I'm Vox. Mm -hmm. I know... Um, I guess with maybe our next. Boxy will come down. Oh, maybe. Wait, where's maybe, where uh, would you put Boxy? 
through the oh, O and phobias. Oh, Hex yeah, is nice, scores well. That's good. Although I think I would have preferred Boxy or Vox just because it closes down those eights, which are super open, unless yeah. Annette is counting on the fact that uh, Brian hasn't been finding those, which is, is it's a good read, but it's risky. Um, so I wouldn't be surprised if Brian plays Yao up at the top for a lot of points. Scores plenty of points, keeps a good leave. There's 11 tiles in the bag. I think it's his best chance. I I don't know. I'd be... Oh, Ooh, see, I, I think I would have like done what he did because I wouldn't want to... You want to keep anything open, you can. It's just five points left than, less than um, up top, and I think it gives Annette some good places. Yeah, she can just play boy there and score a lot. You're right. Yep. Um, and once again, Brian is left without a bingo. He has a cool hook to boy, which is boyo, and he can play oval. Oh, yeah. Plays off, gives him a very nice leave. He has another good chance to bingo. Um, but he needs to come back to this game. He's down 130. It's going to be very risky. Now he has... Oatmeals, if there was an mm -hmm. M on the board. And Lace is, I don't think, going to do it. It doesn't get rid of the tiles that he needs to get rid of. No. I would even prefer, like, Oka, maybe. Um, OCA there, just to get rid of that. Now, oh. this can, can Annette make a mm. like word in the, um, mm. in that triple? Uh, she is gate like? Gate like. I, is is gate like good? I think it's good. I think I've seen it before. It is a real word. It is whether ah. or not Annette sees that little hidden spot in the bottom left to play gate like. Gate like would certainly seal the win and really be the final nail in the coffin. Um, she's not known for missing her bingos, so it could come and come very important. Um, that's a very nice find. Um, she also has, there's no N's. If there's an N or an O, she is gnat like and goat like. Um, but I don't think, it's a really tough find. We could keep with the egg theme and she could play Yoke up top, adding LK to Yubayo, but it doesn't score very well. Oh, plays Yox, so pretty close. She is going for another bingo. Um, I'm just trying now, to see what you can have. He has dopants. There are but... no eight-letter words to the E from what she has. So I hope she knows what she's looking for here. Pentados, is that good? I have no it's idea. No good. The only bingo in there is notepads. However, oh, Annette God. has to make a tough decision. I think she's going to know that this is not a word. It looks like a couple real words, but unfortunately it's not. Yeah. And yeah, it's going to come off, which is a shame. Um, Brian, I have had the day you've had today. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'd love to tell a little story. I think one of my greatest skills in Scrabble, I don't think that I'm that good of a player, but I think I am one of the best drawers there is out there. You know, that's what I do. And I was playing with Mac Meller, who's considered to be one of the best in the world right now. Um, it was him versus someone else, and I was sort of switching between teams, watching them. Um, and he was drawing terribly, and I said, let me show you. I am one of the best drawers there is. And he said, I don't believe it. And I was like, no, 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 you have to watch. And over the next three turns, I drew both blanks, two S's, and perfect vowel balance, and he bingoed twice. So <laughs> it's a skill. Well, I, I think it's in the genes. I'm not sure. I, um, I, I, you know, I yield to your... Superior drawing. <laughs> drawing. Although I double blanked your last game, as I recall. That is true. I'm um, worse online, so this scares me. Toei is a very nice play, overlapping everything, and then that's going to win 503 to 399. Um, I think she's going to be coming to join us soon. <sighs> oh, bro. All right, game. welcome back. Okay. Oh. I'm sorry, Brian. I played... That was another tough game. Yeah. Hey, what are you talking about? I won. I won. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I of course you played poop. poop. <laughs> I was looking at it upside down. And egg. <laughs> now so I see it right. 
You missed the <laughs> game-winning play of Yolk, which would win by the egg standard. You know, you've already have egg year on the board. So oh, the shit. Um, oh, man. Oh, that's so bad. <laughs> Damn it. Inframed was, was beautiful. Yeah, that was Inframed really and Hardier were both good, but Conspire came down and that was lovely. It was the only bingo on the yeah, board. Did I have anything else that turn? Um, I No, Conspire was the only bingo that you could have had. Wow, okay, because um, I saw that he blocked my seven. I think Synopic is good. Oh. Synopic, I think, is good with Silverns. Synopic is no good, actually. It's not good? Is there no bingo mm. in that rack? No seven? Hmm. I don't think well, so. I would have tried it. <laughs> um, <laughs> so I want to compliment Annette for um, being her typical defensive mastermind uh, by blocking the only bingo I saw of Tolly Weens when she played Matt. So that, uh, uh, yeah. I didn't like being that. Sorry about that. <laughs> That's kind of what I do. I'm though. used to it. You know, <clears throat> um, yeah. And then I try to do that same thing to, to other people. Uh, whenever that bottom I left rare leads. That bottom left yeah. corner was a I sort did. of hidden lane. Yeah, um, that stayed open for a long time. I was trying to find a way to yeah. like draw into a light word in the end there. You so did have find one. Anything that would fit. Did I? Mm -hmm. Gate like you had. Which oh, that was good. good? Oh, mm -hmm. I saw that. I was like, I don't think that's good. Yeah, I was trying to find a way to fish off the G and draw into another one, but I could. I, I don't know the like words that well. It's mm -hmm. tough to know which ones are good and which ones aren't. I feel like I'm just guessing with those every time. But once again, I think, Brian, you're going to have to practice your drawing. You did well here in drawing into a lot of yeah, the tiles. Yeah, you drew better. You just drew into all of the good tiles at the wrong time. Yeah. I was okay. curious about my opening play, though. Did you Silver? watch that, Beth? Yeah, no, because I, I, my first rack, I had basically silver and without the V, and I had an F, and I exchanged F. Oh, that's yeah, And I wanted to know if exchange one was the right move there. I think that's I, probably a fine play. Yeah. Filer I could is, play something like FIL, too. I Filer think just hits with equity. so many. Yeah, it's... I don't know. I might have traded off the F and the L. Um, yeah. But... It worked. Hey, you never argue yeah. with what works. Um, so and so all of you are are being very nice and you know partially correct by saying that I haven't been drawing well. But feel free to um, like bring up any like strategic mistakes you saw. Get like given my word knowledge or anything that might. Why help did you me play wham? Wham! Wham! <laughs> wham! I brain no, I, and then As I soon said, as you saw that, I, I was like, shit. <laughs> And I like said I knew, in chat, I knew I he said, knew. Yeah. yeah. Like I knew he realized like, that it was bad words. So I passed back. Mm -hmm. That was. It's, nice. it's one of those things where I I I saw W A T and then I was like, oh, maybe I'll be, make it a little bit you, better. You think all oh, it out. but I don't think. Right. Yeah. Uh, We've all done that. All, yeah. yeah. Um, all the only other that. thing, uh, just in the beginning, I think like you had meow m i a o u one of those nice vowel dots oh. instead of exchanging, mm -hmm. which would have gotten the m to the double. Um, mm -hmm. Oh, in my first turn? Mm hmm Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Mm. That, that's a good point. Yeah. I, well, uh, Rust is not going to be happy that I missed that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're letting If he were still here, I definitely... He would have told me that, that play if you were here, but he's over there sleeping. He would have been like... All right, so I think we're on to our last game, right? <laughs> yeah, let's go. Let's do it. Brian, right. I will tell you, too, I, I would have definitely traded when you did. I wouldn't meow? have played the meow. So, oh, okay. Thanks. Hey. Anyway, all right, I guess we're on. So mm -hmm. I am muting out of here and saying goodbye. Mm -hmm. And have a good day. Good luck. Send us the link. Out of curiosity. <laughs> we'll never know. What, are you <laughs> what is yeah, Heidi now laughing I want to know. <laughs> OK, let's see if we can pull off their game. And they are all nice picture of all of us, I have to say. It is. I think so too. They did a good job. Okay, here's the link. Okay, let's see. So is this like for the win? Well, I guess it depends. <laughs> I don't know. I don't look at standings. <laughs> I don't really care, but I'm just for me not curious. To. 
I'm just curious. Yeah, this is for the win. That makes sense. Yeah, so this is going to be the last game. I hope you guys are enjoying it so far. Of course, like I said before, subscribe to the channel, give it a like, all the good stuff if you are having a good time. Yeah, this is uh, this is for the the win of the our little tournament, you might say. Yeah. Yeah. This is the So final. do we have any technical issues here? Like what is the problem? I'm not seeing what I should be seeing. Oh uh, it yeah. looks like Beth exchanged the first turn because I have the game open. Um, and then Jeffrey exchanged, and then Beth exchanged okay. again. Now I have no idea what's uh, so going on. Okay, three there we go. In a row. Now we have now we have a rack and we have a board. Um, let's see. Yep. So has there been three, three exchanges. exchanges so far? Is that three? Okay. Three. So does that mean that Jeffrey can't exchange here? No, this isn't Scramble Go. Yeah, Six, but if he Six, exchanges and zero. Beth passes, would she win the game? Is what I'm asking. If she has a good draft. No, this is this is four so now. He, okay, so that's this four. is four exchanges. Okay. Oh, I see. But two two more scores of zero, and we have a. Mm -hmm. We'll have a. a so are we going to see a play game. here? A very uh, interesting spot. Uh, yeah, very interesting. Especially after exchanges, you don't really want to give any floaters. I could see an exchange here again, but it is a little just risky. Case. Just in case Beth has all one pointer, she can decide to just pass next turn, hoping I just, that yeah, Jeffrey I, picked up a two pointer or something. Yeah, let me so just I would point probably out in case play anyone doesn't here. know that. Let me just point out right. in case anyone doesn't know that uh, if there are six consecutive scores of zero, um, then the game just ends. And mm -hmm. the uh, amount of their tiles gets subtracted from both scores. Uh, so that's what makes this interesting. She needs to really think this through. She has she has nine points on her rack. Uh, right. So if Jeffrey she just exchanges, exchanged one, like so he, he probably has. Yeah, he probably has only one point tiles, which makes it makes exchanging here very dangerous. Very risky. So a lot that's of the time, so Jeffrey is going to have picked up a one point tile. So she decides to play, which I think is the right thing to do in this spot. All right, that was a good one yeah. of her best plays. Yeah, that seemed fine to me. So did he pick up anything here? I don't see it yet. Yeah, I don't see it. Oh no, looks pretty good. That's a good draw. Oh no, it's the so best equity she's, play. Nice. So she's definitely going to bingo here. It's just a question of mm -hmm. is there a double double? Um, let's see. So play Santera. I feel like she could have taken a little bit more time there to find something that was maybe a little more defensive. Um, okay, um, so there's a question. There's a question in the mm -hmm. chat about um, how we arrange our tiles. I, I assume the person's asking when we play in person in tournaments, like how do we arrange our racks? So a lot of people- I don't think Tadrier is good. Tadrier is good. It is That's good, fun. wow. Mm -hmm. I know um, Tadris. So most people like to put their rack in their letters in alphabetical order. Because if you just keep doing this, uh, then you recognize patterns um, more often uh, if you're consistent about this. Uh, and especially if you have a high probability rack and you always see it in the same way, you're, you're mm -hmm. more likely to recognize it. Uh, so the person asks, if we have a blank, what do we do with that? So mm -hmm. um, I tend to put it either on the very left or on the very right. Or if I'm trying to think about specific letters it could be, then I often put it in the place of where that letter would be. Like if it's an I. Right, that's kind of what I If I, I want it to well. be an I, I put it in the middle. Um, right, or like if I'm playing live, I'll, I'll write down the alphagrams with the letter that I'm intending to make the blank just to see if right. like something jumps out at me. That takes a little more time though. Uh, so <clears> there's a good spot to just drop the X here. Axel looks good too. Yes, uh, Axel was um, another, or was a higher scoring play. In the, mm -hmm. going right in the same 
Yeah. So I'm pretty sure out higher is not good. I probably tried to play that before. <laughs> so I'm then sorry, what? what? I'm saying out higher is probably not good because I feel like I've tried to play that before. <laughs> out higher is probably not yeah. good. <laughs> Okay, um, so Howry is looking very good for 32 points, H-O-U-R-I. Um, that looks pretty really good, even though it does open a pretty big, big scoring spot. Uh, you could fish oh, with something like Doe and U-H. That looks pretty good, too. Um, let's see. Okay. Definitely want to get rid of J. Um... So important to know those hooks. So um, Beth uh, adds an E to Axel to make Axile. Mm -hmm. Nice Val bunk of Euro. So maybe someone in chat points like out that out higher uh, is CSW only. Of course it is. <laughs> yeah, I'd probably play something like Jow here with Ta, just to get rid of the J and the W. Sets up a good spot for the Y next turn. That is indeed the highest equity. Pay. Ooh, Joy. Is hey, Joy is fine. And, well, Tay isn't good. So that's, that's clearly that's... not the best play. <laughs> I can't criticize yeah. that. Yeah, that does get challenged. Good challenge. Always hurts to lose a turn. <laughs> That's a lot of a lot of eyes there. That's not something you want to see on your rack. So I don't know what I would do here. It's tempting to exchange just because that is quite clunky. Yeah. I have um, oh. uh yeah, I mean, you have some hooks there to DO if you wanted to go that route and play for some points, but it's like... By, by far the best eyes. play by 25 points of equity is Ophitic, O-P-H-I-T-I-C. Oh, wow. I've seen that. I don't uh, think I would have found it. I have yeah. That is a tough find. What do we have as a second play in the examiner? Um, basically that. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. That. Yeah. For, um, okay, so Jow comes down. Yeah. Okay. That might have been a typo. No, probably not a typo. No, I, I feel like that would have been said in the chat and then there would have been a pass. Plus the Y is for the W. So right. Um, so you could play something just like OP here, keeping. ING to go with jog next turn. It's maybe a little risky, but it's a decent leave. Might be something to consider. Yeah. That is the highest equity play, also. Mm -hmm. I mean, so, you do can you also find just that... play something like pig or jip. Do you find that when you have ING, you're a little bit more inclined to keep an extra eye? Yeah, it depends. As long as there are spots to play the ING bingo, if I hit it, I don't mind keeping ING that, and like right, having that, another eye a, with ING isn't terrible. Yeah, having a place for the ING word. Is, is right, better. so I would say now the Y hook with Doji would be pretty good to play something with. Um, so I <sighs> see nice Art more in chat. Mm -hmm. I see Art Moore in chat. Uh, I'm wondering if he, I was going to ask if he knows that word, <laughs> if he knows all his art, <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Right, right, right. Yeah, that, that's a good play. Keeping that's a Y, the, though, but play. I guess that's fine. Yeah. Don't mind that. Yeah, that's score 29. Mm -hmm. um, it's kind of a tricky rack. So 
Yeah, the kind of wrecks I've been seeing today. So yeah, you've had some rough ones. Um, I don't know. Maybe there's something like Infi down to the eye. Bimini could be fun. B i m i n i. Yeah. Yeah, that famous uh, eye dump is playable, yeah. B-I-M-I. Uh, but there's also Min Bar and Mini Bar. Oh, Mini Bar. I've missed that so many times. I did not know Min Bar with just one eye. Yeah, that would be fun, too. But min, so min Bar is also a word and scores more. Yeah, did not know that one. Art says he does know all the arts. Uh, nice. Extensions. So Every like word this. starting with art. <laughs> <laughs> Just like Dustin knows all the words that has Dustin in them. And I know all the seven letter words that have Bunzo in them. There's nice. Only one. How many are there? <laughs> There's just one. Let's see if anyone in chat can come up there with There is so one. The letters. Bunzo. The letters in my account name. I don't know if I know this. Uh, switch name, etc. There's one seven containing. Bunzo blank blank. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I am by. That's kind of fun too. Ooh, someone picked up a blank. Ooh, so I don't see any good place you? here, really. Um, what do you do? Just drop the Q? That kind of sucks. So that's that is the best blank. equity play. Yeah, I don't like that. I would probably just play something like YA next I am by making Y and AM. Yeah, that's also close in equity. Also, I think it's just too, yeah, it's just too risky to drop the Q there. It sets up a huge double double lane if someone has CS and can hook QI both ways and get a double double. That's just, it's just not worth it. I think it's okay to keep the Y or the, the Q here for a turn. Just see what develops. I mean, there are three U's in the bag. And, and you have a blank. Um, right. Could uh, help you out. Yeah. Raya looks good to get too. Rid of the Q. Oh, there are the U's. <laughs> there they are. Now we know who has those. Oof. Yes, Jared. Good job. Subzone <laughs> is the only Bunzo blank blank. What was it? Sub zone, S U B. Oh, nice, nice, good find. So if you see bun, if you see bunzos uh, using an E to pluralize <laughs> bunzo, bunzos, then you know you have. <laughs> right, you know you have a have a bingo. <laughs> oh, so so Raya does come down. You were saying you don't like this because of the double double possibility, right? No, I think this is fine. I was just saying okay. I didn't like QI because of the double double. Uh, oh, yeah, right. So here, I it's think I would probably exchange the Q. And, uh, and yeah, so I could um, make a case we're keeping the H and the L too. Exchanging QL seems to be the best exchange, and it's close in equity to playing ETH. Um, okay. Right. Forming AIT and YAA. I think I like exchanging here. I think you just bingo so often. If you do. It'll be interesting to see though. Oh. Okay, so exchange, exchange was made. Two. Do we know how many? Two? A condo looks like yeah, you HQ. play. HQ um, was exchanged. Okay, that's probably fine too. Okay, very findable uh, seven here for the best play. Remembering comics. our suffixes. Yeah. Comics. Yeah. Pretty sure, yep. Yeah. Yep. As expected, comes down. Nice find. That is a bad Ooh, draw. Is right. Ouch. <laughs> that is clunky. Very clunky. Uh, when you're only so... when your only vowel is a U. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, so do you just play like okay. Vuln down to the T E? Ah, that's just so rough. Flap, I don't know if I like that very much. 
that's just going to cause a lot of trouble next turn. Like I get wanting to block that, but sometimes you got to do what's best for your rack too. Mm -hmm. He's down by 60 points now. Right. You want to. Yeah. I don't know if she can of... afford to keep that VU combination there. Yeah, exactly. Uh, what would you be thinking about here as Jeffrey? I mean, I would try to find something that would go from the C, but I'm not seeing anything that reaches. Um, and I would like to keep the board open at least if I can. Why is that? You're, you're up by 60 points. Oh, Jeffrey is up. Oh, of course. Okay. Okay. So that changes things. Um, so maybe just something like Pied down from the P. Close those lanes. Yeah, there you go. Good. Nice. Yeah. Um, here. I don't know. I feel like that was maybe played a little too quickly. Again, keeping the VU, maybe something like Fusey down to the R. I don't know. It's like the board is just really, really, really tough to do anything with now. Mm -hmm. Which is great um, for Jeffrey. Like, he really doesn't even have to do anything here. I mean, he so can play something wanted, like... Hmm? I want to take a second to you just say. point out if there, are, if there are newer players out there. There's a comment in chat. The person might be joking about not being mm -hmm. able to find bingos. Uh, but um, uh -huh. it's helpful to look for common prefixes and suffixes. So like um, in that spot, Jeffrey had EST. Um, mm -hmm. So, you know, if you you want to look for things like that or like ING, like we were talking about before, and that can really help you find at least one bingo to put down. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, then it then it's just about, you know, anagramming four letters, you know, hoping to find an adjective right. among those four letters. Yeah. So yeah, calmest, blank uh, bingos can be very hard. findable even for a newer player. Interesting. So she plays off oh. the U. That and was a very Saga quick turn of events here. 34. Saga comes down. Oh. And Dostia. Very Dostia. nice. Great find. Very good find. Denotes was the only oh, other thing. Oh, universe down to the uh, E. If she sees that. Ah. Uh, Definitely yep, a the only common book. word. Tough to see, though. I think she can see it. I feel like it's one of those racks that if you have that, you're kind of like looking for the E on the board. But let's see. It's kind of a hidden bingo lane, though. Yeah. So she ends up playing Vin. Gets rid of the V, at least. It's so a pretty good spot now, here Jeffrey's for by for Jeffrey, yeah, and he knows exactly what Beth has, and he's not really yep. worried that about anything. It. Yeah, so now he just needs to find a way to get rid of his Q without giving back a bingo. Trying to see if any of those floaters would give back an eight to her. I mean, blushier maybe if an eye comes, but I wouldn't fit anyway. I mean, I think he's pretty safe. Okay, so he doesn't. Interesting. Yeah, but now what do you do with your Q? Like, did he just Q stick himself? Jeffrey in our private chat is um, kind of cursing himself. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> as he realized what he did. <laughs> I guess so. Yeah, now what do you do? <laughs> I, I don't think it'll matter. Yeah, no, it will. games in the bag. <laughs> <laughs> Should he just quit? <laughs> oh, yeah, so oh, he did get go. a spot for his cue. He was given a spot. <laughs> little time left, under understandable. Yeah, yeah. They're just blitzing out the moves. Okay, so a uh, <laughs> couple quick plays to end the game. Jeffrey is our champion for the day. Uh, yeah, very 459 nice. 459 to 351 in our, in our final matchup. Congrats, Very Jeffrey. good game. I don't know what happened to my time. 
I, I yeah, also you had some, some rough racks there. <sighs> that was a cool game. Yeah, it I, sucks when you have that VU combination. Nice job, Jeffrey. I, Thank you. Yeah. I thought men was very men at the end. Oh, we can put skills in Can anyone hear him? No. Say it again. I think you're Jeffrey, muted, we're having trouble Jeffrey. hearing you. It's very hard to hear it's you. It's very sorry. quiet. Um, Try again. You're still very quiet. So maybe we'll just spend this time complimenting him. So uh, How what were you impressed we by in this game? talking about me, 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 which is... I so did you actually had a bingo? Rats, but <laughs> you had a bingo what? when you played Vin? Did I? Oh, yes. Yeah, you a had universe word. down to the hard to e. see. Yeah. Down oh, to the wow, e. universe. E can you hear me now? Doge. Yes, we can hear you. Can you hear me? When I yes, played yeah, better than before. When you played Vin next to Indostia, you had Universe I had down to the Universe? E. Universe, yeah. You did. Universe, down to the e, right? yeah. yeah. You had the whole universe yeah. at your disposal. <laughs> and I had no time. Yeah. Jeffrey. Right. It's Jeffrey, tough. Raya, nice. I'm not sure if I would have seen it with all okay, the Okay, we can world, hear but... you. Yeah, Raya was fine. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, you had a couple of options there that none of them were like amazing, but that was one of the better ones. Jeffrey, you're being complimented for your uh, outplay of out. <laughs> nice. Uh, I like to touch. be very accurate. <laughs> what yeah, I very really nice. liked was Artigi over to that. Yeah, age. that was a good play as well. Yeah. I think the Y was really powerful because it had Doji and then it had the Y on mm -hmm. the right. So I wanted yeah. to keep that. Um, yeah. I was thinking mm -hmm. of phoning some six because I thought it would be hard to challenge. <laughs> Like Jai right. or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You actually had a fun word that turned before when you played Hick. You had Ophitic to the C, oh. which is a very tough one to see, but also I don't think I would have seen that. I know o Like, I know the word, but, but yeah, I don't think I, I would have seen that. Yeah. But that would have been a really nice find. Sure would. But this been. was fun. Congrats yeah. to Jeffrey for Congrats to Jeffrey. Great performance. Very nice. Yay, look at that guy. Whoop, whoop. Nice sunglasses. Yeah. Very well yeah, learned. Very good. Very good. <laughs> this and was thank great. you to all of you for watching. This was really, really Brought fun. I enjoyed everyone. myself. Yeah. Would love to do it thank again. Thank you, everyone. Sometime. And thanks to yeah, Josh for setting this up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And if you guys would yes, like to see more to of this, Greenway. if you guys like to see more of this, I think this channel is planning to do this a lot more often. Just subscribe mm -hmm. and you'll be able to see more videos like this. And it should be fun. Yeah. Yes, indeed. And, uh, I believe we'll be bringing in players of uh, lots of different skill levels, uh, even below me. Yeah, I, I think this was fun. Uh, sometimes. <laughs> Just to be able to have players who don't know all the words, I feel like it's more relatable to watch, especially when you know, the more players come in. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I think this is good for, for Scrabble in, in general, just to get a broader you know, variety of people playing. I hope mm -hmm. you all agree. Thanks for the subscribes today. Uh, almost at yeah, 14. Thank you to everybody get one for, for watching. Before we sign off. Now we got yes! it. Yay! <laughs> awesome. Nice job. Thank you. Yep. Um, well, well done, everyone. So, Nicely played. I had a lot of thank fun. Thank you. I, I had a lot game. of fun as well. Would love to do it again sometime. Take care, everyone. Thank yep. you all. Bye bye. Yep. Bye -bye. Thanks, everybody. Bye. 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 If I want it, gotta make to myself a promise. I won't quit, got it. I won't give up till I'm on top. Yo, no, I ain't the type to give up. If I do something, man, I do it till I get what I want. I turn a business out of nothing into something I love. I got a poker face, but honestly, I'm not one to bluff. I flip a switch, never miss, man. I always stay up. Don't let them see you, bitch. Always have a plan to stay tough. This life ahead of you ain't easy. It was built to be rough, but that's what makes a personality is tragedy, bro. So keep your head on your shoulders, now we rocks, we out here moving borders, now we ain't getting postal rides, we out here making posters, and we ain't got nothing to hide, we move forward like soldiers, you better wake up for the pay stub, or you'll pay up, don't make love to the game, bro. fuck the game up, change up, for your rain stuff, to your greatness, famous for the way up, play the game, bro. Never stop, don't get it if I want it, gotta make to myself a promise, I won't quit, keep going till I got it, I won't get I'm on top of it. No, I'll never stop it. I won't quit, keep going.
until I got it. I won't give up till I'm on top. I'm always flirting with pain. She likes to hurt me and maim. I'm always working to change, but she's still lurking the same. I keep on building a dynasty while the haters be trying me, but they hate from inside. You see, hate themselves as society. So I let them speak quietly while my actions speak wider. See, they be hiding in privacy with the screen. Oh, the irony to hate someone who's trying to be whatever they would like to be. We all feel the anxiety. We make our own rivalries. Yo, so where is all the positivity? I feel like we all just hate on everything is killing me. Thoughts build quick, causing different possibilities. Negative thoughts will cause different disabilities. So do better. Work hard under pressure. If you got no time, work smarter than ever. Don't ever let them tell you that you can't ever say never. And turn your mind into the truest to go get us. Never stop. Get it if I want it. I gotta make to myself a promise. I won't quit, keep going till I got it. I won't give up till I'm on top. Yeah. You know I'm always honest. There ain't no way I'm ever stopping. I won't quit, keep going till I got it. I won't give up till I'm on top. Yeah.